What are you doing? Are you hitting the button? Are you hitting the funny button that makes us go live? Did you hit that button? Did you hit the funny go live button? You already know this fucking song and dance. Hi, everyone. <laughs> Hello! All right, let's, uh, let's hit some shit and announce the stream. You can look at this picture of my wife's cat in the meantime. Oh, she's the little licker. You, you have to say hi to Kiki. You have to be nice to Kiki. You have to. You do have to. You're obligated right, right to. now she's obsessed with looking out the window because there's been there's been like a big bug stuck to the window for, for a few days, and so it's driving her insane. What if there was a big bug? Think about it. Imagine the answer it. might shock and surprise you. I'll probably stand to turn up the music a little bit more. There we go. This is also a quiet song at the start. Uh posting my shit so people know I'm live. There's a thing on the screen? Yeah, it's a bird. It's a damn bird. You never seen a bird before? Learn about birds, okay? This stream we're learning all about birds together. Um <laughs> that's definitely what this stream is about. This was a damn sparrow. If you ever heard of it. Uh hey, thank you, pretty hater machine, for the seven months. Uh thank you, Abyss. 19 and thank you you're at the party for the 42 months uh have i posted my shit everywhere not on tumblr let's do that okay now i'm going to close the tumblr tab uh, hi everyone hello this is the bird game no well i mean there's birds in there is birds in there's there there is famously birds that you can see multiple points in the Splatoon games. And um, you should. I don't think there's birds in this DLC, though. Suppose um, we'll find out. I, I, I guess we're gonna learn today, but my understanding Perhaps is... kind of like a bird in this one in an abstract way. <sighs> Be because she small flies and has a beak? Yeah. There's more to being a bird than that. Hey, can I get a spicy well, chicken sandwich with a medium drink? What's my order? Uh. <laughs> Thank you, President Dark, for the 20 months. Um, the TDS did cut off your message, so I do want to give that a read because it was a good one. <clears throat> hey, can I get a spicy chicken sandwich with a medium drink? What side order? Oh. Uh... Thank you for the 20 month three sub, I really appreciate it. And thank you, Nisok Tango, for the five gift subs. Uh, and thank you, Robin Crumb, for the 39 month three sub and message of lesbians. Lesbians. Uh, so, what have we been up to lately that we can talk about at the start of the stream before we get into the meat and potatoes of just talking about this DLC? Because that's going to be a lot of this stream. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get anything oh, else God. out of the way. That's a good question because. What a, a, a big thing we've been up to, we can't talk about for another, like, two weeks. Yeah, um, I am a little bit losing my mind in a good way. Thank you, Deaf Dude, for the 26 months, by the way. Much appreciated. Um, losing my mind in a good way because I'm gonna, like, have an actual official, like, author and, like, editor credit on, like, a project that is going to be seen by people in the mm -hmm. world. Uh, <laughs> I I say that and I start feeling a little bit like Johnny Chaos. Like my head is spinning and Something swimming now. <laughs> Johnny Chaos, the good edition. Um, I'm not I'm not gonna say what it is just for the sake of like. Well, you'll see soon. Uh, you could probably make some educated guesses about it, but uh, yeah, you'll see. And I'm excited for other folks to see. Did I write the Bible? No. Master Gerb mentioned a big stream. Unrelated, but I hope you're looking forward to this weekend. I'm um, looking forward to this weekend. I think that's going to be a good time. Um, yeah. But yeah, it's uh, it's it's been neat getting to sort of like uh, Hi. wet wet my whistle. That's not quite like the right word. Like dip dip my toes back into like doing more uh creative writing work like on 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 someone else's project with like some really really cool people to collaborate with. It's very exciting. Mm -hmm. And yeah, um, I've I've mostly been, I've mostly been working on that stuff on on like, 
What what's the word like? Um, jumping, spinning, clam. I, I have been doing that. Actually, I've been doing the opposite of that because I I got a cold about a week ago and that threw off my entire like past two weeks. Not you, because you did the cold get was really very bad. sick. You did get really sick. I wasn't even really sick. I I had a mild cold. But because I decided to be responsible, which you all should do if you get any kind of illness, mm -hmm. is I, I decided to be responsible. I was like, okay, I'm like withdrawing from society. I'm not going to go out to do any work or any classes or any like of my, my side hustles. I just took a few days and like rested and did literally nothing. Mm -hmm. But because of that... I fell way behind on a lot of things, so now I'm kind of, I'm kind of as you do, crawling back unfortunately. up. Unfortunately, I'm, I'm crawling back up the cliffside a little bit right now, so it's mostly just been I'm resting, and then I'm getting upset about all the stuff I didn't do while I was resting. It turns out a lot of the like modern uh, social contracts of the world that we live in these days are very much not built to accommodate for the fact that people are alive things that get sick sometimes. Uh, <laughs> weird that. Weird that. Weird that. I wonder if anyone else has ever noticed this. Um, <laughs> you thought that was just you? That's what I'm saying! It's <laughs> strange, isn't it? <laughs> um, but yeah, so I'm, so I'm picking myself back up and very excited to, to be dipping into cider. Cause I, I think that... I I I I know this is like a joke on the intro, but I think it fixed me. I think it actually fixed me. <laughs> <There's>... <laughs> a after playing a little bit last night, I like I genuinely feel better than I have mm -hmm. in like two weeks. <laughs> That's good. I'll 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 talk about that in a little bit once we get to like the proper bits of the stream. Um, mm -hmm. We did watch um, more Dungeon Meshy. I was finally like awake oh, and available God, yes. to like hang out with some of my like later night folks. Um, and watch uh, more episodes of Dunmeshi. Uh, it's a it's really real good. fucking good adaptation of the original comic. Like, uh, it, it's, it is extremely faithful in terms of, like, the writing, but it's also really faithful in terms of, like, recreating, like, different panels. Not necessarily, like, it's, it's not, like, explicitly interested in just going, like, shot for shot, but, like, a lot of it is very clearly, like, yes, this is, like, this was a panel from the comic I remember. This was a panel from the comic I remember. This is uh, a scene from the comic I remember, but they're now taking advantage of the fact that this is a moving picture instead of just pictures on my screen. Uh, it's yeah. really cool. Uh, the, the animation on the Kraken fight was, like, next The level. fucking that Kraken was episode was so cool. cool! They, 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 like... Cause, Cause like in a lot of the panels, it's just like, yeah, you have the giant squid and then like a tiny little drawing of just a little guy um, <laughs> out there. And then like they have these like massive sequences of like this huge thing, like sprawling across different parts of the screen. And then you see like the, like, the characters like running at it or flying at it or getting bounced off it. It's really cool. It's really cool. It's really cool. And then they killed Lyos, which is sad. They what? Well, Lyos killed Lyos with, with his parasite. <laughs> he ate the raw fish and got really fucking sick. Um, and he threw up all over the floor. And it, it, the series is over. It's over now. He died. It's so sad how that happened to him. He got a tummy yeah, ache he, worse than God. Uh, he, he has a tummy ache and he is not being brave about it. His his sister literally dead, eaten by a dragon or whatever. Uh, he, he has the worst tummy trouble ever in history and uh, basically was erased from the timeline because of it. <laughs> it was really sad. Um, I also got to watch like... I want to say exactly one episode of Bochi the Rock. Uh, the ads oh are about God. to play, by the way. Uh, <laughs> is, there's your warning. Okay, there it is. They're happening. Uh, anyways, I I got to see exactly one episode of Bochi the Rock because uh, it was what folks were hitting up after we finished watching and getting caught up on Dunmeshi. Um, and I, 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 the episode I watched was like, what, two or three episodes into the series or whatever? Something like that. Yeah, right. yeah. Um, so I, I hadn't, like, watched it from the top. Uh, I thought maybe I'll try to, like, seek out more of it at some point. I liked what I saw. Um, yeah. 
the animation is really fucking fun. <laughs> it, it's very fun, and like, it's. This is gonna be a weird comparison because they're not similar shows in pretty much any way. Uh huh. But for me, very specifically, it hits the same vibe of like fucking Azumanga Dayo in like, oh. Yeah, this is like me and all my other weird girlfriends in high school. Like they they got the energy exactly right. <laughs> it's 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 a very fun like slice of life type of show from the looks of it that like feels compelling, I suppose. A, a, a lot of those aren't really for me. <laughs> a, a lot of those are just kind of I kind of shrug at them. <laughs> Uh, th this, the one episode I saw was, had a very fun energy to it. I really, really good, like, facial expressions and, like, body language. Uh, they, they, they get real weird with a lot of the, like, faces and poses. Um, I was under the impression that it was a show about adults because I kept seeing everyone post that one character who's like a sad, wet, stray dog who drinks a lot of alcohol. <laughs> um, and so I was like, okay, well, people are posting about her so much, so clearly she's a main character. Uh, and she's like hanging out with uh, Bochi the Rock and stuff, which is her her full name, I've decided, is Bochi the Rock. Um, and if you call her anything else, yeah, that's I'll her crime. Um, and so I was like, oh, okay, so they're like, I don't know, they're they're in like college or whatever, and they're 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 struggling and figuring shit out. Uh, no, this is a character that apparently only appears sometimes, and the fans really just like her, I guess. Mm-hmm. They they <laughs> love that sad wet cat woman. <laughs> People just like the adult, drunk, and pathetic girl. I follow a lot of lesbians. Yes, true. However, <laughs> you'll 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 forgive me for perhaps um. <laughs> putting two and two together to get five when the same was true of like dungeon meshy and they ended up being pretty spot on in that regard <laughs> <laughs> different situation uh-huh <sighs> i've watched two consecutive shows about disasters i suppose i have haven't i it's compelling it's 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 fun when you see a person fuck up so bad, worse than anyone ever in history, um, and then you get to point at them and go, "Oh, that's like me, but worse." And then mm -hmm. you get to feel things that way. Yeah. Oh God, Marcel's temper tantrums are really good. I'm I'm so glad they let her continue to be pathetic and unsettling. They make her so fucking sad. Um, and at least in, like, we're watching the Japanese version, the, 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 the sub version. Uh, her voice actress is so fucking good at, like, the temper tantrum screaming shrieking. Mm-hmm. She's, she she's, sounds so <laughs> pathetic! She's tortured all the time. She's tortured all the time. And it's great for her. It's awesome. Is nine mm -hmm. ads back-to-back -back normal? Uh, yeah, it's a, it's a three-minute block of ads because they make me run three minutes so that we don't get ads for, like, ha like a whole hour. Yeah, it, it's based on total length of time, so if they give you a lot of short ones, they can just cram as many as they want in there. Sometimes they just give you, like, two, and they're, like, ten seconds long each, and they go, okay, well, we tried. It's, it's, yeah. it's... It depends on a lot of things. Your region, your, the, the, the block of time. It's... it's it's a it's it's a whole thing, but this is specifically why I run ads at like specific blocks right before we start the actual stream and like during breaks. You thought there was a command? There is, but only I can use it because I don't want random spamming chat commands. It's annoying. <laughs> mm -hmm. I would like people to use my chat room to talk instead of trying to play with the bot like it's their dumb toy or whatever. You know. Well, Adrian's allowed. Adrian has permission. <laughs> Adrian only. Of course, as soon as I fucking say that. <laughs> also, you can use the punch command. Everyone's allowed to punch. That's okay. That one's allowed. That one you are encouraged to spam. Uh, I think I have that cooldown set as low as possible. <laughs> but everything else, it's set up so people aren't just like spamming commands or whatever. Yeah, I know, Neo. I do want to hit up the dub eventually specifically because I want to hear what... Prozidi Senshi voice sounds like. I've heard it's a I, pretty I have, fucking good dub. I, what little I've seen of it seems great. Ironically, the only things I've seen have not been Senshi, the thing I want to hear most. <laughs> I've I've only seen 
the one clip of him yelling about bread. Um, <laughs> and I don't, I don't think that's enough to judge um, an entire dub on. Uh, but mm -hmm. I think I preferred the delivery of like snarling old man in the Japanese one for for <laughs> screaming about bread specifically. <laughs> oh, he's so feral about that bread. It's great. Uh -huh. It's it's real good. Yeah. Um, the the one English dub bit I've heard is is the the Marcial voice actress talking to Lyos like he's a fucking dog with something in his mouth. Just going, Lyos, Lyos, no, no, Lyos. That, that kind of is their like whole character relationship. <laughs> oh, extremely so. <laughs> at least, at least a lot at the start. It, it, it tapers off a little more as the series goes on, but <laughs> yeah, they, 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 they work on it. But also, he's a little part of him will always be dog with something in his mouth. Ah, <laughs> uh, a little. <laughs> and then, and then Marcy is like sad wet cat, mm -hmm. and then we get actual sad wet cat. Oh, I cannot wait for sad wet cat. Except more like angry wet cat. <laughs> well, that's that's kind of a sad wet cat if you think about it. Mm -hmm. Dog with oversized parasite in its mouth. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what one of my favorite things that I saw recently um, was just as as more people are like getting into the series. I'm I'm seeing less and less like weird head ass people being like, oh, Lyos is like such a little baby man, he doesn't even know what sex is or whatever. And more people just like drooling and slavering over that man. Yeah. Um more people like need him expeditiously. What one, one good one person I follow posted like a photo set of him uh in like a couple different panels they really liked and they just captioned it something like oh man i want him i need him so bad uh and then they <laughs> reblogged their own post days later and in the tags just went whatever <laughs> <laughs> and i keep thinking about that <laughs> oh yeah slutchware chill checks a dub va i keep forgetting this is uh what is their name they they did they did floofty and does uh, the the news Shinji in English? Oh shit! It's them. Yeah. I also they're, forget they're their name. But that's cool. Casey Mongillo, thank you. Oh, neat. Is that? Did, wasn't there something about them doing like some kind of homestuck thing, or am I misremembering completely? Oh yeah, absolutely. <laughs> okay. For for some reason, like I never remember. Oh, that was Shinji. Oh, that was Floofty. I just remember. Wasn't there something about them and Carcat? I don't remember what or where. I just remember seeing people post about that, and I was like, oh, huh. Harcat real, I guess. 2022? Real. Confirmed. I don't actually know if it was in 2022. I think it was in 2022, or at the very least, it was like... As with most things recently, it was... One to three years ago. <laughs> I also... Because I'm really fucking bad with names... Because I'm really fucking bad with names, and their last name starts with M. And, like, sounds vaguely Italian if you squint. I literally always mix them up with Gianni Matragrano, and I'm sometimes just <laughs> like, Gianni's not binary? Oh shit, good for them! No, he is not, as far as I know. <laughs> Other one. <laughs> That's a different guy. That is a different guy. <laughs> Uh, let me play the let me play the start of the stream music so we can get the stream started. Um, oh yeah, the stream we're here to do. Right, the thing that we're here to do. We're getting all of the not talking about Splatoon out of the way so that we can spend the next what eight hours in a row talking about Splatoon. Something like that. Something like that. <laughs> <sighs> Is there something else I wanted to talk about? I feel like there was, and I don't remember. I, I, every time it's like a little bit before I stream, I feel like I need to get like a list together of like things I want to talk about um, mm -hmm. on stream. And then I always forget to actually get a list together. Can I talk about what I had for dinner? Um, talk about my niece? I don't fucking have a niece. What, you mean Lana? Do you mean your cat? Um, people, How is Lana? People in my server keep taking pictures of my sister's cat, dear sweet beloved Lana, 
and like photoshopping her into food so that it looks like she is getting cooked into food and eaten. Uh, and it's really fucking funny. This is how you tell me you're pregnant. Knowing you, I would not be surprised. <laughs> <laughs> Knowing you, I would not be surprised. <laughs> you totally would do that. Um, anyways, I have to show uh, a really good picture of Lana. Give me just a sec. Give oh, me just a sec. Um, let me find it. Where the fuck was it? Uh, I think everyone's really going to enjoy this image once I save it. Uh, I'm also going to blow my nose real quick before we get started. I'm going to mute. Okay, so have fun! That. Uh, here it is. Uh, transform. Fit to screen. No, no, no. Um, stretch to screen. Oh, well, I stretched it out. Um, is it fit to screen? There we go. <laughs> it's pretty good. <laughs> That's a good Lana. Oh, right. Also, my dinner. Um, so yesterday I was like, I have a craving for spaghetti and meatballs. There's a thing of like pre-made meatballs in the fridge that we got from the store, from the grocery store. Um, they're like really big meatballs, but there's, you know, there's some sauce in there. I'll, 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 I'll gussy that up a little bit. I'll add some, some extra vegetables, uh, some extra seasoning, uh, more garlic, <laughs> stuff like that. Um, so that'll have a nice, a nice, a nice meal to eat. Hi everyone. Welcome to the stream, by the way. Let me play the- Welcome to the stream. Let me play the music while we're still talking a bit. Um, so, you know, some, uh, I added some broccoli because I really like broccoli with tomato. Uh, especially when it's like a, a nice cooked down kind of like browned caramelized broccoli that goes real good like that or like a nice long braised one um some some extra garlic uh, a bit more onion because i had some onion to use up um some extra tomatoes because there wasn't a lot of sauce in the packet uh and then i put in the 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 the, the sauce that was there uh, and like you know cooked that all up together um there wasn't a lot of sauce, considering there was six fucking huge meatballs. And they were like, oh yeah, one serving is like one or two meatballs. Um, so I just, I took out the rest of the meatballs and had two of them with my, my pasta. And there was enough sauce for one serving of pasta. And they have the nerve, like after adding more to it. And they have the nerve to go, yeah, here's a serving suggestion. Just cook these and put put, put it on pasta. Put, put, cook this and put it over your favorite pasta. And it's like, th there isn't enough <laughs> sauce for that. <laughs> so I'm glad that oh, I added sweet. a lot of extra stuff to it to give it more body. Um, it was pretty good. It was, it was all right. Um, I went to bed last night and had maybe the worst acid reflux of not of my life, but some of the worst acid reflux I've had in a long time. Um, I was gonna say, on on a level two, the the Denny's experience. What are we talking? Um. Well, the Denny's experience was a little bit exacerbated by the fact that I ate it so late, right before bed, and also had the stress of having to wake up early to go on a flight to leave my wife. Mm hmm. That said, a pretty fucking close, if not surpassing Denny's. Ooh, that's bad. Oh, uh, it was pretty fucking bad. It was not good. Um, so today I had more meatballs to use up. So for dinner I had some meatballs with some leftover rice and some peas. Uh, and that was it. <laughs> it was all right. What'd you have okay, for- Okay, dinner. What'd you have for food, hun? Um, I, I, I had like a late- big breakfast so I ain't had much more than that so far because it's still a little early in the day for me mm -hmm. but but I had I, I decided I was actually gonna eat healthy for a change and so I made I made a scrambled egg whites with with some cream cheese in to make it nice and fluffy and a bunch of like chopped up uh spring green mix yay and some miscellaneous like herbs and and such Technically, I did eat butter because I used butter in the pan to, to cook the scrambled egg. Right, but you didn't just eat butter on its own this time. Not this time. 
<laughs> just, just put on some bread at least. That's all I'm asking. <laughs> I know. <laughs> oh, but yeah, I, I had that. Jake on, Kaufman, like, your music um, is too uh, fucking loud. Turn that shit down, my man. <laughs> but yeah, I had that on like a big toasted fluffy whole wheat uh, in English muffin, which was real good. Nice. That does sound good. Uh, hi. Welcome to hi. my stream. I guess this is the point where I can flip over to this screen and people can see the really good new talk sprites that you made for the stream. I made these literally today because we decided on doing this stream, like, yesterday at 10 p.m. So, yet the, the, the whole plan for today was we weren't going to stream. Puzz and I were just going to hang out, uh, and I was going to watch her play Side Order because it was like, well, I'm, I'm looking forward to streaming this and playing this myself. It'll be a lot of fun. It'll be a good time need to do it anytime soon it's not it's not urgent or anything i don't mind waiting um mm -hmm. and i was like well i know i'm not gonna be able to wait until i'm ready to stream right. it, which is gonna be a long time right. because of my graduate degree mm -hmm. but i want to play it so hey how about i'll i'll set up my capture card and and we'll uh we'll we'll i'll play a little bit and Hall yeah. can hang out with me and we'll have some nice wife time right so so last night we realized okay so the DLC's out a little earlier than uh, the 22nd, because it released the 22nd in Japan. Uh, so how about we boot it up and, and, and play, and I'll, and, I'll, and I'll watch my wife play it. And then we realize, oh, your capture card might actually be dead. Yeah, I, I might maybe not have a capture card anymore, so uh, please stay tuned for, <laughs> for streams to take a little bit longer you're, on you're, my end. Your, your capture card was also, like, old and kind of on its, it's last like legs. It's, like, really old. It's, it she is was an old so girl. old that all evidence that it ever existed has been scrubbed from the manufacturer's website. Uh-huh. That old. Um, so then it was like, okay, well, I still want to hang out um, with my wife and spend time with my wife. Uh, you know, just kind of hang out, idly chat while she's playing it, just kind of, like, on her own. And then I think to myself second account set up from when I was streaming the Splatoon 2 single player. I can see if the DLC works on that and I can play a little bit of the intro like on my own and see how that is. Uh, so I do that and I boot it up and I play the intro on that other account and I'm just like... Oh, oh god, I need to play more of this as soon as possible. Uh, <laughs> yeah, so, it, it got us in the fucking hooks. <laughs> uh, it's fucking good. Literally all I've done is the tutorial and then like two runs that died. Something like that, yeah. Uh, it's really fucking fun. So it was just kind of immediately like, okay, do you want to stream tomorrow instead of just us hanging out? Because we'd, we'd still be playing this anyways. <laughs> mm -hmm. So, uh, here we are. Uh, yes, I do see everyone in the chat making off-the-hook jokes. I want you to know I'm giving you a thumbs up through the computer. Yay! Uh, through the microphone. Um, Turning around, looking looking at my my plethora of marina and pearls all around the apartment. She... In chat, she is not kidding. She does, in fact, have more than one pearl and marina uh, in her apartment. I've I've got I've got the amiibos right behind me right now. Oh, over by like my bed. I've got uh, these beautiful keychains. My my buddy Hallow got me, mm -hmm. and uh, and the the Figma set. Mm -hmm. If I can get more, God willing, I will. <laughs> I love those lesbians. <laughs> me too. They just like us for real. For real. Uh, before we get really into it, uh, real quick, thanks for tuning in. Uh, if you're new. You can hit the follow button if you want alerts on when the stream goes live and if you want to, you know, use the chat and hang out in there. Um, if you're old, your birthday is coming up. Uh, happy birthday. Uh, if you want to support the stream uh, financially, you can subscribe to the channel. Uh, you can give out gift subs. You can do bits. You can tip directly through Streamlabs and PayPal. And that just goes to my wallet right away and I tend to get a bigger cut. Uh, financial support. Any and all forms of it, any amount you're able to give, never mandatory, no obligation, never feel like you gotta. Uh, always greatly appreciated, though. This is, you know, this is one of my main sources of income, I suppose, is a more apt way of putting it nowadays. Uh, <laughs> and I'm certainly able, one of them. Certainly one of them. 
Uh, and I'm able to, you know, keep doing this and keep dedicating more time to doing this on the regular uh, as I as I do because of the very generous support of folks like you. Uh, so thank you all very much for, you know, helping to keep the lights on, uh, helping me buy grocery, helping me get a nice thing for my wife every now and then. Baba! Oh, I gotta go check for Baba. Fucking Baba! No, no, two days, two days. They, they, that's what it was! They put out a fucking Baba is you plush! Oh, <laughs> Baba is gamer. plush. And I was like, fuck! I want that! I need that! And so I was like, hey, hon, is it okay if I buy a Baba plush and, like, ship that to you to, like, save on shipping? Hey, is it also okay if I get you one, uh, as a gift so that we have our own Babas together? <laughs> Babas too. So we have two babas, <laughs> or we're going to at least. They're they're supposed to arrive soon, and then I'll get to see them next time I visit, and we can make them kiss. Yeah, it's little smooches. It's it's like it's so stinking cute to like an illegal degree. Mm hmm. I I saw like notes from from like at least one of the folks who who worked on designing it and mm -hmm. all the little details are like. Yeah, that the eyes are, like, slightly, like, off-kilter from yeah. each other. That the legs aren't, like, perpendicular. They're yeah. not 100% even. It's just like the sprite! <laughs> it's so cute. It's so good. Anyways, if you want to support the stream, then it means every now and then I can get my wife nice stuff like this. <laughs> mm -hmm, please. I, I... Back when I had disposable income, I used to get a lot of the Fangamer catalog. Pay my wife so that I can live that life again. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Um, anyways, quick shoutouts to um, subs and resubs and stuff that I missed while I was talking about stuff. Thank you to Orc Peon for the $3.33 tip and message of something need doing. Uh, thank you, The Great Zellos, for the new sub. Uh, thank you, Abyssive, for the new sub. Thank you... Is that Cabby or Cabble? You'll forgive me if neither of those are right. Maybe Cable? Uh, you can tell me if any of those are right, or you can never tell me. That would be kind of funny, actually. Thank you for the brand new sub. Um, uh, thank you, Tracen Group, for the nine months. Wraithclaw, for the 34 months. Aquacure, for the 36. Lady Satan, for the 18. Uh, Potions Wizard, for the tier two at three months. Uh, Stormy Buckets, uh, for the 22 months. June.gov, for nine uh, Alchemizzy for two, uh, and Dunmesh, funny enough, I think that came up when we were talking about the Dungeon Nashi anime. <laughs> Saw their chance. <laughs> for the 17-month resub, uh, with, with message of, does anyone know how to go back in time so I can sub five months earlier than I did? Oh, I get it, because you have 17 months and then it would have been 22 on the, on the 222 day. That's pretty good. Uh... <laughs> Thank you, Gameslayer013 for 45. Thank you, male wife Adrian, uh, for 45 months. Uh, who, who is eating mashed potatoes, or was eating mashed potatoes like half an hour ago? Uh, Alabaster allowed? Labs. I, I hope that's allowed. Alabaster Labs with 24 months. Uh, Cosmion with 11. Uh, Deaf Dude with 26. I think I already said that one. I think I have already said all these ones after that point. So thank you all again for the subs and the tips, etc., etc. Uh, is that all the stuff I normally say at the stream? Read the rules, review the rules, uh, don't tell me how to play the video game, it's fun to try and figure things out on my own. Um, talk to me like I'm a person instead of like I'm a fictional character. Um, these streams are intended for mature audiences, but don't talk about how much you want to have sex with a fictional character in my chat room. Uh, etc. Things like that, you know. <laughs> Common Behave decency. Behave reasonably. <laughs> Behave reasonably. Make a make a fart and a poop joke in moderation. Uh, and have a lot of fun. These streams <laughs> are. Hang on. Flame flaming embers in chat says these streams are intended for Mater. No, Mater is banned <laughs> from my fucking chat room. Fuck that thing. <laughs> Fuck that thing. No. <laughs> Let me get uh, the video game up on screen so that we can see the video game and play the video game that we said we were going to play today on stream, the video game that I want to play, that video game. Oh, right. We are here for a video game. 
the video game. We're going to play the video game. That damn thing that we were going to do today, the video game. Play the video game. Video games, I've heard of them. We're going to play the video game. <laughs> More like this stream is intended for a hater. That's a good message, Doc. I appreciate that message. Uh, I forgot there was a fucking Nintendo Direct, wasn't there? Oh, or yeah. Like, or like the partner showcase thing. I didn't watch it. I forgot to watch it. Yeah, there, there are some weird ones, and I say that with, like, totally positive connotations. Like, mm -hmm. fucking... All right, you guys get Endless Ocean again. Oh, yeah, they're, they're putting out a new Endless Ocean, uh, and I saw some people talking about it, and, like, the new visuals don't look super great compared to some of the older Endless Ocean games, which has mm -hmm. me just kind of like, damn, really? Okay. Uh, they, they look kind of washed out. Uh, okay, capture card. Um, they did shadow drop Penny's Big Breakaway. They did just go, and yeah, by the uh, way, it's out now. Uh, it's so <laughs> sad that I, it, it's not available in Southern California until until May until May 2024. Yeah, it's, it's, it's so sad. It's, it's weird and it's so sad how that happened. Um, I did have someone immediately in my chat in my my uh my server. Thank you, Sadie, by the way, for the gifts of the Lightning McQueen. And thank you, Cricket Guts, for the nine month three sub. No sub um, oh, hey, Cricket. What the fuck was I saying? Right. I, I did have someone in my chat, or not my chat, my server. I'm pretty sure it was literally Sadie. Uh, go into my, my game recommendations channel and go like, yeah, Penny's Big Breakaway is out. Yeah, it looks really good. It's a, it's a good looking 3D platformer. It looks and sounds good. Yeah, yeah, whatever. It has a EULA. And so that made me go. Okay, I might have to get that soon. <laughs> I, might, I might have to pick that up soon. Okay. <laughs> I might, I might have to do that one soon. <laughs> the Eula is so long. Two hundred bucks, and I do it. Wait, no, it's the wrong save file. Fuck. Not, not. I don't do it tonight, but two hundred bucks, and I do it. <laughs> Let's play the video game. Oh, Splang Toing. Mr. Costco, if you're out there. Donation incentive of $200 to read any EULA. I'm considering it. It's a good idea, I'm considering it. Is the audio a little crackly, or am I just hearing things? It seems a little uh -huh. crackly. Give me a sec. I'm going to... Yeah, no rush, no rush. When this happens, I just fucking... I just, I just bounce the capture card software. Collective dollars or one donation? Collective. It's the goal for tonight. I didn't, I didn't come to stream expecting a goal, so I just had it set to 69. <laughs> 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 Hang on. Uh... Capture card. There we go. Show it on stream. Stream it to my wife again. Yay, I love to see Splang going. I love to see Big Man. Anyways, it's Shiver Fry and Big Man. Game updated. All thrilled. Yippee! Go to the website. If you'd like to learn more, uh, the Splatoon 3 is proud to present the fact that Sniperwriter has not received any changes yet again and continues to be dominant at the top end of the video game. This stupid ass pencil is still <laughs> way too good. <laughs> you can get more catalog points if you want to. Hey, thanks for the tip. But there's secular pods in this one. There sure are. All right, here we go. You want to do the okay. voices? Who was doing what? I keep forget. Uh, you were doing <laughs> Fry. I was doing Shiver and Big Man. Got it. Time for our next segment, Rumor Fillet. Do I keep just doing the joke I was doing of Big Man? I'm going to read the actual text because it's good. <laughs> <laughs> That's a segment? Sounds fishy. 
Would this be the rumor about the spaced out wretches packing in Coppolis Square? Is she allowed to say that? She's just calling them dipshits live on stage. <laughs> yeah, I heard about that. You think it's true? I have seen fewer people from Inkopolis Square in Turf War or punching the clock. Hey, you're right now I think of it. What's up with that? Did they find out how rad the Splatters are and throw in the towel? I know! We should go live from Inkopolis Square to get the truth! Big man, are you just angling for a way to expense a trip to Inkopolis Square? I just thought it'd be cool for our viewers to see another side of Inkopolis. He's so real for this. He just <laughs> wants a fucking company budgeted trip. He wants it so bad. Please, please expense my train tickets. He's begging you. He's begging you. Well, not you, but he's begging the higher ups. Boss, please. Boss, please. Boss, please. The trains even run to Inkopolis Square! Although something fishy is going on there. Your call whether you want to get involved! <laughs> you want to deal it's with this your bullshit? your kid! Alright, get blown up if you want to. Hang on. I don't think that's true, but respect, Baro Rider. <laughs> so... There's something in Inkopolis Plaza that my wife noticed the other night. Oh yeah, this scared the shit out of me. So you know how- And I have to reveal it to all my friends who are also confused as fuck. So you know how you go here and it's like the little the little baby twins that are like, hey, we're, we're manning the store, we're here for you. Howdy, howdy. Only one of them. Just one of them. I, I literally, because I didn't buy the DLC at all until, until, uh, the, the drop last night. Like, I kept meaning to and then forget it, because, you know, I'm in grad school. I don't have a lot of time to game uh -huh. these days. So, so, I, I decided, like, while, while I was trying to figure out, or no, it was while you were, like, downloading, I was like, oh, I'll go and check out the, the, the plaza real right. quick for the first time while, while my wife's downloading the, uh -huh. the, the, uh, the DLC. And so I go in here, and I'm like, Oh, so is the joke that, like, the second one's gonna come out and, oh my god, there's two of them? Like, is is that the bit? Because it's my first time here? Hey, there's dialogue was... about this! What?! Hang on! Huh? You wanna know where Donnie went? Don's gone. He's running another lo- Location somewhere else. But don't worry! I can take care of whatever you need all by myself. Okay, so I was about to say, I have a theory about what this might be. I've seen some other folks play, and so I know how, like, some of this goes. I don't know what all you get for, like, finishing this. I have a sneaking suspicion now that you do, in fact, just unlock the other plaza when you beat Side Order. Don't tell me if I'm right. I have a feeling now. <laughs> but yeah, so I was like messaging my friends in paint chat like hey this is gonna sound insane did you guys have both of the little sheldon babies when you go into the shop for the first time everyone's like yeah and i was like cool there's just one there's just one <laughs> so i'm so scared and confused <laughs> it's it's just shelly and i guess smelly is off getting like uh brain zoned or whatever everyone else is getting in the other incopolis All these items was, that got added last update, I haven't looked at them yet. It was a very fun and confusing way to start the DLC. <laughs> it sure fucking was. You you had to, like, take a picture with your fucking phone so that I could see yeah, it. Yeah, because my capture isn't working. <laughs> That's what Sheldon said anyway. Don't call the kindergartner that? What, smelly? Oh, whoops, I hit the wrong button. Are you- are you reading all of them? Why are you reading all of them? Stop! 
Oh, wasn't there something you said you wanted to show me when when we started stream? Oh, uh, you'll see. I I hit. Oh, the we haven't button. gotten to it yet. I see. No, no, no. We haven't started the DLC. I think I hit oh. the button of say everything to me. <laughs> I'm just gonna reboot, because I think that's faster. <laughs> I think that's faster, what I did. I wanted to hit the button to make us look at Fred Crumbs, and I hit the tell me fucking everything button. This- this is what hap- this is your punishment for wanting to subject me to Fred Crumbs. I just wanted to look at Fred Crumbs. I- I just wanted to look at Fred Crumbs. Is- is that such a crime? I mean, not technically, not legally. Mr. Crumbs, where are you? 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 <sighs> Mr. Crumbs, I missed you. <laughs> Mr. Crumbs, I missed you. Okay, where's the fucking subway? Let's go to Inkopolis Square. I love to go to Inkopolis Square. It shows the right headphones for this cutscene. Mm-hmm. do this to a motherfucker. I just noticed little buddy sleeping right next to you. Yeah. Eepy. Hey! Hello! Up and at him, mate! Yo! Hey! You awake or what? Do you know who you are? Can you see me? That's the eight I know. Nice. You hadn't come around. I didn't have a plan B. What's up? I got something on my face? Right! You wouldn't recognize me like this. I'm Paul! You know, your bestie! I love that we get this, like, identical shot to the fucking Craig Cuttlefish <laughs> incident to the start of the, the three campaign. Mm-hmm. Just... <laughs> the awkward silence. No! For serious! I'm legit Paul! Not sure how I got this way, but here I am! So you know the thing that I said I was gonna set, say to you that was like fucked up and awful? Uh-huh. She looks like the robot from Flubber. I don't know the robot from Flubber. She looks like the flying drone from Flubber that wants to fuck Robin Williams. I don't know her. Okay, well... Maybe that's for the best. Everyone else in chat who knows what I'm talking about is going to be mad. <laughs> <laughs> Frankie's mad. That's all I need. <laughs> post your, your fucking flubber emotes if you have them. <laughs> <laughs> Announcement from user Friendly Frankenstein. I'm going to get you. That's fine. <laughs> I can live. Uh, not sure where Marina went either. She's supposed to be with me. Hey... Don't tell me you don't remember Marina, either. <sighs> it's cool. You just woke up. Might take some time for your head to clear. I've had some Saturdays like that. 
That's regular me on the left, okay? With my $2 million jacket. And the one on the right is Marina. My awesome promo render of me and my wife that I always have to display at all times. I've always got it. You never know when you're gonna need it. I, I don't know why I'm a robot, but don't worry. I definitely have pictures of me and my wife that I can holo project to you. It's fine. <laughs> Thank you, Sepmal, for the raid. I hope you had yourself a wonderful Hello. stream. I, I was I was watching Sepmal earlier play a bunch of play a bunch of this. It was a fun time. Fuck yeah. You got any idea where we should go from here? Marina's usually around to help me with that. We being normal about lives? Oh, you fucking bet we are, my man. <laughs> I feel so normal every day. Yay! They should let me dress up like Pearl for my graduation. They honestly should. They should. Oh! Duh. We should go find Marina. She'll know what to do. My wife is so smart. Come on, eh? Let's get going. They, 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 they play like the little... <laughs> The little scratch track riff that plays when <laughs> when they're shouting out the stages in two. It's so cute. Mm-hmm. Let's look at some scenery instead of playing the video game. So there's like all there's all the bleached coral around. That's like the obvious bit, and all the grayscale buildings. There's just like this awful full bright void out there. That's probably fine, right? That's normal. It it used to look like that, right? It always looked like this. Wee! You can glide, by the way, on Pearl. I love her little flappies. <laughs> the flapping is really good. I've never gotten a close look at it before. <laughs> it's weird seeing like a place that you knew that have you haven't been to in a while, and it's all covered in dust and sand. Coral. Mm -hmm. This place kinda looks like in Goplas Square, but how do you get like this? Marina! Hello! Marina! It's got a cool glow to it, doesn't it? It does. Look look at the like falling, like it it looks like snow. I think it's like diatom skeletons. You have y'all ever seen those? Those are hmm. real cool. It looks like ash, but like in a snowflake shape. Mm hmm. There's like all the little bits of like gold filigree up there and like almost circuit oh, board I designs. I love how the, the gold looks. Yeah, that's a real good touch. And it's like, you know, interspersed with the sort of like. It, it looks like drawings in sand that also look like the surface of like coral. Mm hmm. The shapes appearing in the sky sometimes. Dude, my, this is my shapes world. It's awesome here. Uh, good news to report for everyone. Never mind, bad news. Marina? Are you up there? Hang on! We're coming up to you now! Shake a leg, eh? Marina's at the top of the tower! We can chew the scenery later. <laughs> Wife to save. Wife to save. Oh, fuck, I need to protect women. Are those lockers? I don't remember those being there. They appeared later, question mark. <laughs> Looking for your wife in a ruined town with a spotty radio girl, you're in Silent Hill. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit, huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, is this for real? Wherever we are, it's nothing like the Inkopolis Square Tower. What would Alan Wake's inkling Sona be? He would be a Salmonid. That feels right. Oh, I'm getting the heebie jeebies. Keep your eyes open. Heads up, eight! Yes! Look at them, they're oh. so cute! These designs are so good. Oh, trouble's coming for us. Use these! My guns that I had! I do love the pose, it's fun. Mm -hmm. You remember your way around a weapon, right? 
Press the R to show them who they're dealing with. Shoot them in the head. I will shoot you with my gun. We got oh. more incoming. Weird guys will appear. Oh, that one's huge! What we get ourselves into? <laughs> oh, I think that was the last of them. The, the the enemy fish designs in this are really fun. I'm a big fan of the huge fucking parrot fish. So you just have this smiling grinner that knows the world's its dinner running after you. Oh, there's going to be one that we see later that that Holly and I have been obsessed with a little bit. Oh, I know exactly what you're talking about. I'm excited for that. <laughs> also, you'll, you'll, you'll probably see more of this as we go on. The attack animations are really fun and funny because they just waddle up to you and take a bite. They, 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 they just waddle up and go for succulent bite. <laughs> oh, take a big bite. Also, yeah, the, the ink right here like at the start and then like the lobby is like all sparkly and kind of gritty. Mm -hmm, it's real pretty. The, as usual, the design is just great in this. Mm -hmm. There, there will probably be quite a bit of like, ooh, hang on, forget what we were saying. Look at this, look at this. Huh? Where'd I get the weapon from? I don't know. Your guess is as good as mine. Just felt like something I had in me, you know? The elevator. Oh, but never mind that. The elevator's running again. God, I love the, the enemy ink, too, how it's got that almost, like, translucent, watery look. Yeah, it, it's like... It looks greasy. It doesn't quite look like crude oil, but it looks greasy. Mm-hmm. Oh, we can sit and scratch our heads all we want, but why bother when the answers are up there? Let's get moving, eight. Uh, Twilight Prince 101 in chat asks, Okay, is this Brutalist? Good question. Next question. <gasps> Hi. You want those fish we busted up? Sick of me! Kill! Do you want to voice them? Ah, uh, hmm. Do you want to voice them? I'll take it if you don't want to. Do you want to? I feel like you should do it just because there's a lot of back and forth with them and Pearl. That's fair. Okay. <clears throat> what fucking voice do I do for them? Uh. <laughs> cool it. I'm not your enemy. Just another bystander who got sucked in. I take it you two followed Marina's voice here. Say what? You know Marina too? First things first. I'm Oct. As for Marina and me, we go way back. For real? Yo, lead with that next time! I'm Pearl, and this is Eight. Call me in your act. I've been in the area since I came too. I heard Marina's voice from up the spire, so I came to find her. Oh, yeah, uh, as of literally this DLC, uh, canonically, constantly they themed in a move I did not expect from a Nintendo game. Yeah, really, really cool. Uh, pretty, pretty neat, actually. Mm hmm. I'm into it, I'm into it. But there's bony fish found me first. I call them gelatins. Skeleton jelly is finally real. 2024. Err, why I'm trapped in an elevator. The spire's crammed with gelatins. This wound they gave me hasn't healed. So... I'm stuck. Yikes! Things aren't look super good for the home team, huh? I don't count us out yet. I've been waiting for an Octoling with a drone. Said your name was Eight? You're the one I needed to see. 
Okay, Pearl. Now check out what happens when you set this color chip into that palette. Palette? I'm supposed to know what that is? What's a game mechanic? Oh, are you talking about this thing? You got it. Now set this color chip into it. Okay, but whatever happens is on you. Here goes nothing, Eight. Slap that chip on in there. It's fine. You can just take weird chips and put them in your best friend who is now a computer. It's fine. Don't worry about it. It's good for you. Whoa! Is it me or did your weapon get stronger? They, they do such good expressive animations considering this is just like... A dome with eyebrows and the flaps. <laughs> it's so good. In in general, like, especially, you know, reflecting on Octo Expansion as this DLC was inevitably going to cause, it, it really drives home how much work they put into, like, the facial and body and just general animations in this game compared to, like, the, the last game. Mm hmm Like, all the cinematic animations are so good in Splatoon 3. Her fucking flax! <laughs> You could set a whole bunch of color chips in here. You could walk all over those fishy freaks. No doubt. Play your chips right, and you could make it all the way to the top. Whatever's going on in this city, Marina's in the thick of it. Or, so I'm assuming. But this injury's left me sidelined. Our strike team will be limited to you two. We're on it, Oct. Deep breaths, eh? It's time to go find Marina. You didn't know Oct is non-binary? That's fucking awesome. No one fucking did until literally last night. <laughs> that's this that's DLC what we're saying. is a day old. <laughs> it's less than a day old, technically. <laughs> I think as of like, it, it's it's five my time. I think literally twenty four hours old as of right now. <laughs> All right, hit the button for the top floor already. Love to. But this elevator only goes up one floor at a time. What? How come? You mean I gotta be patient? Was confirmed in a tweet months ago, actually. No, because they did that shit for Shiver as well, and Shiver is not non-binary. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, you can never be sure till you see it in game. Just the difference you know, is different. they are constantly textually they theming her. <laughs> Sorry, they theming them. <laughs> Get my ass. <laughs> <laughs> like in the text of this DLC. Shiver should be? Yeah. But they didn't. <laughs> I can't believe I just did a fucking e <laughs> his pronouns are she her by accident. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> we literally did a hey girl, I mean they. Yeah. <laughs> you can get my ass, it's okay. <laughs> Dude, I literally hate being patient, it's the worst. Patience fans be like, not Pearl. <laughs> yeah. I... We were talking about this yesterday, but I do, I do really like the, like, the, the, I don't know if cinematography is quite the right word for when it's a video game, but, like, the way this scene and, like, the camera in it is shot, it's, like, it, it feels very, like, detached and distant and far away while also making the scene feel, like, really cramped and, like, stuck together. Mm -hmm. It's, it's, it's it, really cool. The elevator is a cool framework for, like, what this DLC is trying to present to you. You're all just- you're all just stuck in here waiting. Going through the motions again. I'm in a hurry myself. But we play what we're dealt. We'll just have to take this a little at a time. Guess you could call it liminal? <sighs> you could. Yeah, I suppose you could. In- in a- in a- in a very- in a very literal definition sense of the word yeah <laughs> yeah that's not wrong <laughs> <laughs> anyway
And for reasons that aren't yet clear, it's a little bit soulful. Now then, we're almost at the next floor. You two ready? I was born ready. Let's do this. Is it creepy or wet? Both? Pretty texturally both. Like pretty. Oh, the fish, the fish, the, the fish. fish are back. The fish are back. Yes, 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 yes. yes I yes. love these low poly fish. Those fish are so fucking good. Literally the first time I was playing through this, I did not fucking see them until like a while after they swam back around. <laughs> also, God, I love the little, the little jellyfish ass bubbles floating around. They got eyes on them. <laughs> We're up to one F. It's the floor right above the foyer. Each floor has an objective you need to clear. Take care of that, and you can go up another floor. Your objective here is to destroy that portal. This is the we play the video game really fucking slowly and talk about all the shit we see at stream. Uh, so... <laughs> if they didn't want us to do that, it shouldn't have given us one million really cool things to talk about. So let's eat up the scenery for a sec. <laughs> They've, they've got all these cubes with, like, a bunch of, like, decor and home furnishings and things that feel like they're themed around, like, having a kid or a baby or something. That That's a straight-up crib, like, dead center. Yeah. You've, you've got, like, the little toy on the right. You've got, well, it's, like, some kind of picture book on the left. It, it, it It's a little bit Ikea, but not quite. It feels more personal. Uh, mm -hmm. And I'm not really it quite one sure to whom. One person specific IKEA bedroom, not like a generic one. <laughs> no, I don't think the implication is that Marina is pregnant. No, <laughs> 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 I, I don't think it's that type of DLC. <laughs> Listen, I'd be impressed they confirmed lesbian pregnant sex. <laughs> Your objective here is to destroy that portal. Also, the thing you set into your palette is a main damage distant color chip. Now that you've set it, your ZR shots will be do more damage from a distance. I don't like that they give you that chip in the tutorial when you have the dualies, which are famously not a long range weapon. <laughs> mm hmm. There's a practice target right there. See for yourself how your shots do up close and at range. I, I love this weird little, like, water bag filled little the target practice thing. Yeah, it it does look a little bit like some kind of vacuum sealed medical sample. It it reminds me of you you ever see those like the, the, the like pens and such that had like the goop in them and the little plastic toys floating in? It is a little bit that as well, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Well, eight. You want to science it out like some kind of nerd or jump right into the mix like a cool dude, guy? Dude, dude, Pearl is one of those I fucking love science motherfuckers. <laughs> you do 240 up close. And then when you're at range, it's like 310s, 312s. So you got to try and like... The little fish, the little anglerfish rolly toy. You gotta try and keep him at a bit of a distance if you want to take advantage of this chip on the dualies. The little roller fish. The little roller fish. <laughs> the blocks. The chairs. The blocks. Uh, is that a... What is that on, like, the lower left? Lower left? I like, think it's like a puzzle the turned sideways. Oh, it is. I thought yeah, it was, like, either... you see the little piece floating away. I thought it was either a keyhole or, like, a fucking light switch, and I was like, oh, it, is it that... It does look a little light switch. I think I mistook it for that first, then I saw the puzzle piece and was like, oh, I get it now. It's like, yeah, we got, we got baby sliding, uh... Oh, a little, little toy piano. Little marbles cage. We got toy piano. We got rolly fish. We got blocks. Oh, I think there was, we have the clicker from Alan too. Wake. You know. <laughs> there's a little, like, mobile up there, too, I think. Mm -hmm. Boo -boo -boo oh, ring. the little, little key ring. Pancakes. All, all these neat little, like, childhood-like toys and bits you see around, and they're all just, like, neatly compartmentalized here. I wonder what that means. Well, let's not read into it. 
I love my absolutely safe birdie cage. Weeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee
Always love her enthusiasm when you stream even with games I'm never gonna play him like oh yes what's Holly got to say ABT this one and puzz heart not sure when I'll put money aside for side order so this has already been real fun even just in the tutorial smile I literally got back just in time to hear that message <laughs> thank you Cosmignon from the tip that that makes me smile <laughs> yeah, that makes me happy also hi I'm sitting back down Waiting to see. Uh... Oh, I didn't unmute on Discord. That would be why uh, Puzz doesn't hear me. Hi. <laughs> Hi. I, I I sat down and forgot to unmute on <laughs> on Discord. Oh, it'd be like that. You're choosing hubris on the elevator. You have to. You have to. You have to. You have to. Legally, morally, ethically. Can I set the donation goal to 200 for Eula? Oh yeah, I do have to do that, don't I? Hang on. Uh, Might as well do that before before we get back into it. Mm-hmm. Let's see. Uh, we are at $30.33, so let's say... Uh, get rid of Eula. 200. We have this amount. Uh, end after. This doesn't matter. I'm just filling in whatever. Uh, there we go. Okay. So now it's on the screen. <laughs> so now you know. So I don't forget. <laughs> if you want, it's up to you. Uh, thank you, Fear Ranger, for that 14 month resub. Uh, and thank you. I don't remember if I said thank you, but thank you, Interrobang239, for the 30 months. Oh, yes. Jelly. Did I say thank you to Senor Bob for 45 months? Thank you very much. And thank you, Peculiar Top Hat, for 37. Hey, I got one of those. Yeah, I suppose you do, huh? <laughs> I think I've made that joke every time you subscribed on a stream I'm on. I'm sorry. You, you literally <laughs> have done this more than once, hon. <laughs> Like, in this regularly story. enough that I had a feeling you were going to. <laughs> <laughs> I've got one joke. You, you have at least two or three. You be nice to yourself. Okay. Yay. 
Yay! Uh, thank you unofficially, Jam, for the 45 months. Much appreciated. All right, back to it. Poison. It's time to take the poison challenge. Oh, baby, I love the poison challenge. Also, something you'll notice once I point it out, now that I'm telling you to notice it. Um, the, the patterns on your chips that you have affect the pattern in your ink. Oh, I hadn't noticed that. That's very cool. Just get, well, I'll, I'll show you in just a sec. I count three portals this time. Same drill as before, right? No probs. Simply shoot the kill. The poison ink color chip is nice. It says here enemies take more damage while in your ink. Oh, what? I want to see. Shoot some ink around the base of that target there. So the wording of that is funny. What it actually does is it makes them take damage ticks. Not they take more damage. They take damage from your ink. Just being in it. They, they are being poisoned. They, they are, are being poisoned. the poison challenge. As opposed to, like, another one you get later that says, like, it makes them take more damage when they're in your ink. Which means that if they're in your ink, they have, like, a damage debuff kind of thing. Like, this is a D.O.T. That's not what it says, but this is a D.O.T. There's another one that is, if they're in your ink or in your toxic mist, they take more damage. It is a vulnerability. As opposed to this one, which is poison. It's, uh... As, as someone that plays quite a few video games like this, lots of different stacking mechanics, sometimes being really fucking anal and persnickety about the wording of things is really important. Uh, <laughs> like, it's, it's the difference between being like, okay, um, in Warframe, you put in a mod on your weapon that says it's like plus 200% damage, and that is like an increase to the flat number of damage that your weapon does, and a different mod that says you do, like, times 0.2 damage to this specific type of enemy, which takes your final damage and then multiplies it. Uh, d different things have different effects and different math behind them and do d different things in different ways. And you gotta, you, you gotta be careful about the wording you use so people understand it. Anyways, mm -hmm. uh, it's not doing it here. Um, I think we need to get more chips for it to happen, but eventually we'll see there's, like, more patterns in the ink and, like, the colors on your hair change as well. Uh, I was watching Sebmal play it earlier, and he had, like, the afro hair on, and uh, the combination of chips that he had made, like, the giant bulb hair look like Scuttlebug from Mario. Oh, <laughs> Just straight up Scuttlebug on your head. Scuttlebug percent was real. Hop off! Free ink for you. Oh, succulent bite. They do love to bump you and bite you. It's their favorite activity. They do straight up love to run into you and bump you and bite you. And it's honestly so cute. Oh, so it runs through them. Okay. Hey, speaking of runs through them. <laughs> beep beep. So something I've noticed in my couple of runs is that some weapons that are normally a little bit bobo, just by like the virtue of this being a different context, being a horde shooter, perform a lot better in this mode mm -hmm. uh, than they do in like normal Splatoon. Like... There's, there's a thing we'll unlock later that comes, like, by default and start with, like, a sprinkler. I don't know what it is about the fucking sprinkler in this game mode, but it shreds a little bit, and that's scary, because it's the fucking sprinkler. <laughs> the, the sprinkler puts in the work in this mode. It's great. It's fucked. You two are handling this like pros. Maybe you do have what it takes to reach the top. I was gonna ask about that. How come you know so much about this place, Act? Fair question. Everything I'm telling you, I'm pulling from the elevator console. I learned the trick from the same place Marina did. Though I won't blame you for being skeptical. For real? Oh, I guess it's true that Marina's a turbo nerd when it comes to machines. <laughs> they they turned up the sprinkler? Not really. I think it's just that... It's really it good here for mode. some reason. Like, it's still the same as it ever was in, like, the other game modes. It's just, it's on something in this one. This is... 
I want to say this is the first time the sprinkler has ever been an option in like a single player game mode in Splatoon. Like I it's think it's you're right. it's never been in uh like Salmon Run. You just have like the normal bomb there, and then like in the other single player modes, you just have like the curling, the burst bomb, and the normal bomb. And then it's what this one you also have a little buddy. So like you just you can just put out a sprinkler in this one, and it just like annihilates the fish for some reason. It's great. <laughs> Oh, you went to the same school. I'm not surprised you can do the same nerd stuff. Well, if she was a few ranks above me. I wouldn't put myself quite in her league. By the way, here's your next color chip. Lucky! Lucky? Lucky bomb? Lucky for who? These lucky bombs appear when you defeat enemies. They explode on their own for big damage. Oh, sounds great! I'm always wishing a bomb would show up to blow anyone away, anyone harassing me. Pearl is desperate for a bombs. She is always wanting a bombs. I'm always thinking about bombs. In a situation where there is no bomb, Pearl is wondering, where's bomb? Where's the bomb? She needs it. Where is my giant hot wife making a pipe bomb for me? Come on! <laughs> Marina is out here on their hunting moon, building the bomb in the garage for her wife. <laughs> Bombs? You want it? It's yours, my friend. Special surprise floor. Yippee, I love a special surprise. Hey, you said lucky bombs explode on their own? Isn't that uh, kind of dangerous for eight? Nah, it shouldn't hurt either of you, just them. Why? You worried? Hey, I, I believe in eight. Just asking questions, you know? If you say it's eight, then bombs away. Bombs away! Okay, look at the Dumbo Octopus, look at the Dumbo okay. Octopus, look at it, look at it. Straight look at up it. Dumbo Octopus hanging out in the background is really goddamn cute. This is a it's... straight up Marina can. That is a straight-up marina can. That is a straight-up marina power-up. You just get the marina can. But also oh. Dumbo Octopus. What's that Dumbo Octopus? And also the other thing. Looks from here like a can special. Grabbing one will fill half your special gauge. Remember how to use specials, player? Do you remember the function of the game, eight? Do you remember? Do you remember the video game, yes? Hey, do you remember walking? Do you remember breathing? Yeah, there's there's little 3D schools of fish floating around in these levels. Yeah, they're cute, low poly fish ass. Well, I don't think it's an ass. Not yet. Okay. Uh, so the way the chain mechanic works is uh, the higher your chain is, the more likely you are to get things like the lucky bombs to proc and other items to drop. There's, there's, like, other items that can appear by default, and you can we'll eventually get, get chips that, like, uh, increase their odds as well. My bombs! <laughs> Fucking Reef Slider feels good in this game mode! <laughs> <laughs> this game mode's got it all! You just gotta not be a fool like I am, and you gotta remember to use it, like, proactively, aggressively, instead of reactively, defensively. Mm-hmm. I gotta be better about that. It's, it's just like in, like, you know, the other game modes. It's not the, oh, fuck, I need to press this button to not die, because that gets you killed. It's, uh, I'm gonna try and charge in, which is a lot better in a mode where enemies don't really shoot you, can't really shoot you. <laughs> Good hustle, eh? I've got the lowdown on the next floor for you. Whoa, we get two color chips from this one? Twice as nice! Why is she talking like that? <laughs> She's from Boston! I guess. <laughs> Canonical now. <laughs> Reef Slider was always your personal favorite looking special. Yeah, it's a really cool idea that looks and sounds fun, and then anytime you try and use it against like players that are competent, it's just like, oh, this isn't doing much in most situations. <laughs> Which is unfortunate. 
I, I, I don't know what they would do to that special to make it feel more effective, but I hope we get something eventually. It's good in this game mode, though! Hey, I've been wondering. It says reward there. What's that about? Damn, we got fucking money in this one. What's it mean? It's how much mem bucks you get from clearing the floor. Not sure what those are for yet, but they seem like a good thing to have. I remember doing the fucking tutorial last night, and I was like, what the fuck do you mean, mem bucks? I thought the currency was pearls or whatever. Yeah, because uh, they did a whole direct about, like, here are all the things you can get in this game mode. Mm -hmm. Here are pearls. You use pearls. Use you can pearls get, for this. You can get pearls and use pearls to do things with pearls. Uh, and then they're just like, yeah, by the way, here's mem bucks. The fuck is that? <laughs> Well, if you say so. Table that for now, I guess. Here's the game tutorial. What do mem bucks do? Don't worry about it. <laughs> Eight, when you need a break from climbing the tower, press plus to let me know. I'll stop the elevator and wait here until you're ready. No sense pushing yourself past your limits. It, it is also a little bit funny that in the game that has Reef Slider as like, hey, this is kind of like a Booyah Bomb, but you can like advance forward with it. Or not a Booyah Bomb, a uh, fucking Splashdown, but you can go forward with it. They, den they then did later add, hey, we're adding Splashdown back, but it's three, and it's better. <laughs> so now it's, it really does feel like Reef Slider's a little bit left in the dust again. It, it wouldn't be a Splatoon game if they didn't have one kind of awkward, over underpowered special that they don't know what to do with. Maybe a little. Anyways, as you get more chips, your weapons get like a glow on them and you get the like, cool headwear and stuff like that. What gives? I'm not seeing any portals. Other game modes! Different objective. This time, you need to ink that zone and guard it until time's up. They really said you will learn rank mode now. You will understand how splat zones works. You will understand how splat zones works. You will play splat zones. You want to play splat zones. You want to play anarchy mode. You want to play more than just her four. You're going to play splat zones. Ah, oh, it's kind of like splat zones. You're going to play splat zones. You're going to play splat zones. Yep. But I don't see a way to get to the high ground with the zone. The wall by it looks ink-proof. I just need to glide from somewhere high up. That's where I come in. Pearl gliding power. Eight, if you ever want to slow your fall, press B while in midair to hang on to me. You can move while hanging on to land a good distance away. It'll only work in octoling form. Zones is the only ranked you can handle. You'll get around to the other ones eventually if you practice at it. Here, here's the thing. He, here, here's the thing. Zones is easy to understand because it's oh, it's like turf war, but in one specific spot only. Um, tower control is like turf war, but in one specific spot that is moving. Think of it that way. Think of it that way, and it'll be less intimidating. Uh, Clam Blitz is fucking scary. Clam Blitz is turf war, but also you have to play football, basketball at the same time. Oh, Clam and then, Blitz and is then scary. Rainmaker is just like capture the flag, but the flag is a gun. Is it like any TF2 game mode at all? You know, TF2 is famous for not having a game mode with like an objective that you have to get on and push and move it around on a track. Clam Blitz is scary. I love it. I suck asshole at it, but it's fun. It is literally like the hardest game mode. As, Clam as... Blitz made me like borderline start crying. <laughs> Aw. It's the hardest game mode, it. especially if you're new to it and you cannot communicate with any of your teammates. Anyways, now look. Oh, that's cool. You've got the pattern in the ink. That's like your chips. It's so pretty, too. And it's got, like, that sort of, like... It's, it's got that sort of glow that's, like, the way the glitter is in this, it's almost, like, reminiscent of, like, certain types of, like, bioluminescent things that you see, like, in the deep sea. Mm-hmm. Prob probably probably intentionally. Yeah. Cool. 
Clam Blitz was the first one you got comfortable with? That's scary. You should go pro. I'm kidding, but that is impressive. <laughs> okay. Here's the trick. Jump! That's the wrong button. No, it's fine. I did it too late, though. So we do it again. It's this easy. Look. Easy every time. Jump, hover. It's that easy. Defend. <laughs> One of them fell off the side. Goodbye. Later, hater. No, no, no. It's that easy. Right off into the sunset! Yeah! <laughs> Goodbye! body's not so bad if it means it doesn't have to do all the work. Maybe being a super cool robot with, like, hovering and beams is pretty alright, actually. Maybe it's you know, pretty alright. You know, maybe I can right. work with this. This next color chip will help with that, too. Use it right, and you'll be a powerful ally to eight. It lets me use Kill a Whale? Now we're talking! What if we gave her a sonic attack? What if we gave Pearl, who loves screaming, canonically the loudest screamer in the world, a sonic attack? I could see this work. Are we both playing? No, it's a single player mode. It's just me. I mean, we're both playing on our own time, but uh -huh. right now in the stream, it's my wife. <laughs> Puzz just wanted to hang out. Five. New floor! Time to bust out the old killer whale! Uh, what? Why oh, kill a fail? Now that was a fail boat! Pearl, you can't use your drone features until the drone gauge is full. No kidding? Fine. Yes, the drone gauge fills on its own after a while. Once it's full, look out, world! Actually, you don't even need to wait. Pick up that drone battery and it'll fill some drone gauge. Now then, your objective here is to get to that turbine- is to get that turbine tower to the goal. This version of tower control is fun and cute and I like it. Mm-hmm. Turbine tower, huh? Best way I know to make things happen is to shoot them. Am I winning? I mean, it's the tutorial, so it's pretty easy. <laughs> yeah. This, the way this track starts reminds me of like a song from Breath of the Wild when you're a little bit fighting the fucking same... like the, the, the Sheikah drones in like the, the temples. Yeah, it's got a similar progression. Oh. Oh. Where do I go up from here? Oh, right. This this part introduces you to bounce, motherfucker. This dickhead. Oh. Good news, though, you get mad up. The beam. The beam! She is obsessed with firing the beam at the objective. It's so She's fucking helping. funny. By the way, they, they do splash down. I should have just walked away instead of trying to do a dodge roll. 
I only have like one roll on this and I keep thinking I have multiple. Long jump, motherfucker. We're at about the halfway point. Cool. Can't believe this is all going down in the middle of a big world tour! By the way, canonically happening while they're on tour. <laughs> Which is really fucking funny to me. <laughs> Just, you, you ever in the middle of like a big concert tour, uh, and then you wake up in the scary world and you're stuck inside a robot? I, I want to believe this happened immediately after they walked off stage at, at the deep cut concert. <laughs> fucking probably, considering how that ended. <laughs> They, they walked off and immediately went unconscious and went to the scary world. <laughs> Just, oh, fuck. I can't believe they'd do this right after our big debut. <laughs> big big man went backstage to say, like, hey, thanks for performing. It was great to meet you. And they were both just face down on the floor. Just like, ah, I, well, you know, it was a pretty it was a pretty big show. They, they had a really energetic set. They must be tired. It's okay. I won't, like, wake them up and get anyone to escort them out. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Uh... <laughs> Weeks later, Big Man is like, damn, a lot of people are spacing out all of a sudden in uh, Inkopolis, huh? <coughs> kind of reminds me backstage after our set. I should call oh, an ambulance. <laughs> Hospital. Hospital. On tour, are you? That tracks. You're some kind of musician, I take it? Yeah, Marina and I are off the hook, the world's most powerful power team. Power couple. Power couple. <laughs> huh. So Marina hit it big as an artist, did she? Is that good? That seems fine. Marina? Hang on, go! We're on our way! I did not like the sound of that. Let's pick up the pace. Yeah, good call. All right, what if longer range? What if longer range? What if more? What if more? What if bigger? Double zone floor. What if two of them? Yeah, you, hey, you know how sometimes uh, Splat Zones maps have two zones you gotta control? Hey, you're gonna learn how to play Splat Zones, by the way. Hold up, there are two zones this time? You'll just have to secure them both. I can barely count that high! I see disc pieces for the drone way back there. Put three of them together and you can give the enemy a taste of the step-off song. I don't know what that does, but I like the sound of it. Let's snag him if we can, eh? My new thing that I'm learning about that I can do. We have two main range color chips this time, right? That'll help us keep them off our tough. Could you look right once they give you camera control? Uh, right and down, I suppose. It was over. Yeah, there's just a bowl of cereal. That's just a straight up bowl of cereal, yeah. That That's just meal. That's just dinner. <laughs> there's just meal. There's there's a cuckoo clock that looks a little bit like meat. Uh, there's Dumpo Octopus again. Just whatever those things are. See horse. 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 More pancakes. Fun treats for a kid. Th there's been stacks of pancakes in like most of the levels, quite frankly. Mm -hmm. it, is, it has been a common accoutrement. Yeah, they they got a pretty like limited but fun set of like rotating props. So now we have big fucking range, and it's very easy to capture the zones. We also have clam. Shoot these guys in the damn ball and they blow up to death. That's the trick. That's the trick. Learn the trick. It takes them out really quick. Uh, otherwise, you're spending a long time blasting their body to do damage. And they shoot bombs at you. You want them? Oh. We got one zone done. Let's play the fuck off song. It's so cute, it plays their off-the-hook intro! <laughs> <laughs> and it makes everyone leave!
Uh, it Getting those is like a random drop from enemy kills, and you can get like luck chips that make them appear more often. Uh, they give you a freebie in the tutorial so that you can learn that it's a mechanic. Because <laughs> you're probably not going to be seeing it often unless you build for it. It's fun, it's fun. It's fun, it's cute. Play on fire! Let's keep it moving. Don't stop till we hit the top! Huh? This is interesting. On the next floor lets you choose your own objective. You get a different color chip for each one. Oh, different difficulties, too. Well, you're the one with legs, eh? Which way are we going? So I've done this before, and I know you just get all three of these. Um, so we're going to start with dodge roll, because the dodge roll is fun. For the funny tutorial, they make you do each one, but you yep. get to cho choice your order. Rolling floor. Remember these fuckers? Oh, man! Not those things again! Afraid so. You're gonna have to get the... <laughs> the infinite balls. <laughs> infinite balls over to the goals. Yo, fuck balls! <laughs> There's good news, though. The balls won't ever fall off the stage. So, I'll come around as much as you need. They put that one in there specifically for people who played Octo Expansion. So... I'm of two minds about it. On the one hand, I miss the risk of you fucking up and the ball careens horribly offstage. On the other hand, for like quick short levels that are largely combat focused, that would suck hellacious ass. <laughs> so maybe it's a change for the best. It doesn't make a bit of difference, guys. The balls are infinite. The balls are endless. Yes! Heal Daddy, you don't need the whole back! The new color chip is dodge roll attack, which puts a little bite in your Dewey's dodge roll. If you really want, you could push the balls around using only those. In, in case you forgot- In case you forgot, you can, you can do a dodge roll! In case you forgot how to move and walk and breathe. So it's like 800 damage a dodge roll. Which is pretty hefty, actually. Yeah, that, that's a couple. So, you can go for the fucking full body tackles if you want. Check this shit out. In. I love this lo-fi beat to explode balls, too. As you do. By the way, yo, yo, huge motherfuckers. That, I don't care. These huge motherfuckers are literally addicted to biting your balls. Oh yeah, they fucking hate your balls. They're, they're literally like a dog. <laughs> Shot him once and it ends! <laughs> they are like a nasty little dog, just desperate to get those things. It's so fucking cute. Mm-hmm. Biting and biting and biting. No sign of Marina on this floor either. Oh, I hope she's doing all right. She's seemed a little burned out lately. I guess we still got a world tour to finish. But after that, I promised her we could find a quiet spot together and take it easy for a while. Aww. So we gotta save her fast. My wife needs a fucking vacation. Get her out of here. I'm taking my fucking wife to Bermuda. Get her out of here. <laughs> Sounds like Marina met the right people after she got free. But this is Marina we're talking about, so I expected as much. Well, you know what they say. No one knows you like the folks you grew up with. Plus, Marina had to learn the language when she got to Greater Encopolis, so... I kinda figure she struggled at least a little. I would love to sit down and swap Marina's stories, but this ain't the time! Every second we spend chewing the fat is a second we're not finding her! Afterwards, though, afterwards, we're getting coffee. Let's go see our favorite guys. Yes! Let's go see our yes! favorite guys. Yes! Let's go see our favorite guys. <laughs> oh, boo boo wheel! It's a little bit boo boo wheel. 
Look at how fucking cute this thing is. Oh, his cuteness! His cuteness. Oh! Check me on this, but are these new enemies? There are gelatins, just like the rest. You only have to beat three to clear the floor. Yo, do they got wheels for feet? Won't that make them hard to catch? <sighs> Whatever. You can take pretty much anything, eh? We got this. Dude, you can handle a boo-boo wheel. You're tough. You're normal. You know, we got a bunch more orange chips, so we got the orange pattern in the ink. The diamonds. We are going a little bit lesbian flag with it. As you do. As you do. By the way, you can make the cage go faster. My disc. They get so scared that they shit a bomb out at you. They're dead. Well, no, two of them are dead. Never mind. One got away. Look at how cute they are. In the poison? They took the poison challenge and they lost? <laughs> they took the poison challenge! <laughs> you get so scared that you're drowning that you just take an emergency shit and get the fuck out of there. It's working. It's working. <laughs> Dude, the poison is so much fun, especially for these guys. Oh, pretty eye now, huh? That will racking up the color chips. See for yourself. You can press X to check your palette. One, two, three. Wow, we got a bunch! Can you handle the dirty bubble shit yourself challenge? Evidently they can't. <laughs> <laughs> Pearl just like me for real can't count past three. Yes, you fucking can. Don't lie to me. I don't know, it's hard! <laughs> Yo, what's up with the range and power stuff over on the left? Yo, these guys have fucking stats? That's weird. Those are the color chip tones. Color chips come in tones based on their effects. Each tone has its own color and pattern. Half a stack of months. Yippee. Thank you, Atlas Glass Goat, for the 32 months. Much appreciated. Yippee! Reddish color chips are in the power tone, so they mostly up your damage output. Once over at your palette, we'll show you which color chips you're heavy on. It should give you an idea of where your strengths lie. Thank you, Maverick Buggy, for the 9 month reset. Much appreciated. Ooh. And if you're done checking your palette, it's time to move on to the next floor. Sounds. I love it when sounds. All right, make my chain go up. My chain oh my bigger. god, does it work with the touch screen? That's great. Apparently, yeah. The color chip this time is Max Lucky Chain. You want to explain what a lucky chain is? No. So basically kill them all. <laughs> We're not gonna do that anyway. Blow up anything. Alright, eight, you heard him. Kill. You kill more things, the number goes up. The number goes down after time. If you keep Yo, the number up, you have a higher chance of getting Weird stuff. in the open there. Here's a weird thing. Explode. Explode. Get poisoned and blow up. Get poisoned so hard you die. Take the poison challenge. I didn't mean to shoot it backwards. It's okay, you can just make them take the poison challenge. It's that easy? It's that easy? Enemy top! The top men. 
They truly do have their top men looking into the matter. <laughs> the big guy Woo! just jumping into me going for the bite! I forgot that they did that! <laughs> uh. <laughs> They're my favorite! They're literally my favorite! They're so dog. They're a they're a big stupid dog. <laughs> really good. Oh, succulent bite, fully loaded. <laughs> Heads up, we're coming to the top floor. That's where we'll find Marino, right? Probably. Now something about it seems different from the floors up to now. Hey, Pearl. Watch yourselves. What's this, Eight? Are they worried about us? Something funny? <laughs> nah, you just sound like Marina when you say that. But enough messing around. Let's go find Marina. No holding back, Eight. This is it. It feels so weird to hear a canonical they them in a Nintendo game, but hey, that's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Number 10. This is where they control runes. That's just a, normal in here. That's just a straight up flutter. Pearl's crown, flutter, something else I in the distance. I think that's the the TV screen that they have in the Off the Hook studio. Oh wait, no, that's not a flutter. That's the little like vacuum platforms. There, you can't yeah, you can yeah, see a flutter in these though. I did see a flutter at one point. It's a different mm -hmm. Octarian thing. They are revoking my nerd card, unfortunately. Sad. It did have to happen. Is that? No way. Marina! So she does 100% have a virtual boy hey, on her head. Hey, Marina! Yo, could she even heal me? Oh, I guess not. She's still tangled up in that weird machine! That is just straight up a virtual boy controller. Intruders confirmed. Commence grayscaling. Sit tight! We're gonna get you out of that thing! Ready to rock, eight? They did just put a fucking virtual boy on my girl. A fate worse than death. The octo weapon ass portals. Mm -hmm. oh, this is such a good boss. <laughs> this is a fun tutorial boss. Uh, get to a better vantage point here. It's two. Howdy, motherfuckers. Out of here. Oh, damn, I was like one shot away. There we go. Alright, it's that easy. I love stuff yeah, happening to the beat in the song. It's fun. It's really good. It's a good song to do. By the way, it chumps. Super chumps. She's just chucking chumps at you. Oh, 
Oh, the sting. There we go. So when I was doing this... Oh, hang on, there's, there's a cutscene. <laughs> Her virtual boy is dead. She's free. Scaling interrupted. Intruders confirmed disorderly. Classifying as dissidents. Who's this fool? I am order itself. A consciousness generated from the process of many who yearn for stability. I am now fully realized. I therefore have no further use for a host. All things will be converted to memory. No! Oh, this is bad. The tower's shaking like crazy and they die. It's over. They love putting these automatic cutscenes that go so fast that it's hard to read the dialogue for my slow reading ass. By the way, now the mode is started. By the way, the tower. Dude, Splatoon 3 is out today. It, it is, in fact, just like the Duviri Paradox, just like Hades, just like Going Under, etc, etc. Begin again, motherfucker. It's side order. Really good opening. Hey! Hey! Please be okay! Oh, thank goodness! Pearl, it's woken up! Oh, and by the way, Pearl's normal. She's normal again. <laughs> well, she's Pearl again. She's- <laughs> That's basically normal. <laughs> Closest she's gonna get. Hey, thank you so much for freeing me. Surprised to see me in the flesh? More you know, look some magic and BAM! I'm back, baby! Check out this sweet new coat! Marina is a wizard, by the way. Canonically a sorcerer. Just kidding. Here's a laptop with her wife background. <laughs> <laughs> this is the gayest they could possibly make it. You have no fucking idea, hun. Buckle up. Oh, exciting. I'm really, really sorry. It was the Traumatic Days in Orderland module that stuck you in drone form, and I did, did all the other stuff, too. I love how sad wet beast Marina looks in these cutscenes. <laughs> yeah, just like... Oops. She's I'm... about to cry at any given moment. <laughs> so I might have fucked up just a little bit, just a lot, more than most Marina, people wake in history up, have fucked, fucked up. up big time! Pearl. <laughs> Say like, what? Dramatic days and... So everyone was like, oh shit, Marina's gonna be the villain, she's gonna be the bad guy, she's gonna be confirmed evil in this DLC. No, 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 no. A fate worse than that. She's a game developer. God, say it ain't so. Uh, right. Let me back up a bit. This is the Memverse. It's a prototype VR... That is a, a virtual reality that I made. She's just straight up got Blender Cube. It's over for her. It's over for her. Your virtual reality? Hold up! You say we've been in a fake place this whole time? <laughs> uh, also, yeah, fucking... <laughs> This, th this is the DLC about Marina being really in love with her wife and being really normal on the computer. L literally fucking uh, nearly frame one as soon as, like, she is confirmed, okay, I'm myself again. We're out of the tower. We're free. Eight is okay. Frame one, just like... And by the way, I love my wife. <laughs> she's just like us for real. Uh... She loves her wife and she's on that damn computer. Uh-huh. That's right. The only real things in the Memverse are our minds. Not even my sick coat? <laughs> that fuzzy cloud we met was Order. It took control of me and caused the whole Memverse to go haywire. It's forcibly connected with who knows how many people to the Memverse. 
Their minds are all in here now. Which is how I got pulled into all this, I take it? Locked. I'm so sorry. I never intended for you to get roped into my mess. It's fine. We have other problems. Like what to do about the situation we're in. You're absolutely right. We need to do something about order. Order's ultimate goal is a colorless world of order. A place with dogs. Weird fucking dogs that are actually kind of awesome. They got toe rings? Is that a thing now? Is, are you trying to make this a thing, Marina? House arrest anklets, but stylish! You know, they are kind of styling with it. <laughs> I'm just saying, if you ever get arrested, it's a good look. Uh, there, I'll have to consider that. There was a really fucking good moment on uh, on Seb Mall's stream. I'm going to do a fucking shout out command because I can. Hang on. Uh, Yippee! Where, uh, like, right after this cutscene, as soon as he got control of the character again, uh, that's Seb Man. And that's wrong. <laughs> Who Hang is on. that? That's that's the wrong one. That's embarrassing. Uh, <laughs> but a little funny. <laughs> I have to wait two minutes on my own stream to use the shout out? Okay, well, Seb Mall's fucking posting in chat. Go click on his name and follow him. Anyways. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways. Uh, as soon as he got fucking control of his character, he walked off to one of these guys just in the environment and took like 300 photos of the same guy. Correct reaction. Very good. A place where nobody has a will of their own. They just do whatever they're told. Day in, day out. Orders using the members to make the dream of that changeless world a reality. What's its beef with change? I Ash, hold up. I thought the members isn't real? Just turn off the computer, that shit don't real. Go outside, touch grass. Kiss a girl! Eat a hot dog! <laughs> Even if it gets what it wants in the members, who cares? The real world stays the real world, right? Yeah, about that. We get more of her beautiful Bishojo drawings. <laughs> and by the way, <laughs> if, artist back. And by the way, if you die in the game, you die in real life. <laughs> look, look at this awesome drawing of me and my wife that I did just have on hand and or whipped up really quick. I've, <laughs> I've drawn us as beautiful, gorgeous, stunning women, so your argument is basically fucking over. <laughs> yeah, about that. Order is using what it calls grayscaling to neutralize the will of everyone that's trapped here. So if someone goes through grayscaling here in the Memverse, it has an effect on the real person. That about sum it up? <laughs> the little sound! <laughs> yeah. Anyone who goes through grayscaling will slowly start to lose their will in actual reality, too. An order's just getting started. It plans to keep pulling people into the Memverse. If we don't stop it, people all over the world will lose their wills. Life as we know it will be over. Yo, that sounds bad! Not on all watch order! Hey, you noticing that both of the campaigns in this video game seem to have, uh... A whole lot of a through line about, like, resistance to change being, like, you know, bad and kind of foolhardy? Mm-hmm. And how wanting things to be the same as forever and just like they were back in the day forever is, uh... Not a good idea. You, you, you're noticing the through line that they're doing here? You're noticing this game Impossible is themes? Impossible at best and actively harmful at worst, yes. Damn, no one told me the children's video game had themes. I'm gonna show up to the function. <laughs> Again, I'm really sorry. This is all my fault. Nope. Nah. I know you had good reasons for making the Memphis. <laughs> I fucked up bad. I'm so sorry, everyone. Shut the fuck up. You're my wife and you're smart. <laughs> does this game contain themes? Not only does this game contain themes, 
This game contains scenes and images. So you best behave. Please be advised. Please be careful. It does also contain Pearl. Write that down. If that creep order hijack your work, it's gonna be sorry it ever tried. I'm gonna bite it. I'm gonna bite that thing. We're all gonna kick that loser out together. Kill. I I love <laughs> Eight's just like wide-eyed, wild stare. Just like. Yeah, I guess we will. <laughs> yeah, she looks ready to start killing now. <laughs> just, just like, I, I have no idea what's going on, but you say I get to shoot people? Okay. <laughs> Where's my gun? Give me my gun. Give me my gun. Where give did my, my gun. Where did Pearl, the dooleys go? Give me my, my gun. Where did the dooleys go? Can I have them back? <laughs> Eight's been out of the trauma world for three months. No, it's been longer. You'll see. <laughs> Stay tuned. You're gonna see very soon, I think. You say the coolest things. Again, frame one. My wife is so cool. <laughs> also, check this shit out. You'll check this shit out, eight. Nice. Don't worry, eight. I got you back. Marina is out here like, and so by the way, I've been making a secret video game this whole time, and I didn't tell anyone, and I kind of, and I kind of messed up a little bit, and I need your help, and Pearl's like, all right, all right, that's cool. So what's with this robot body? Oh, you know, I figured if you ever came into my video game that you might want your own special custom robot body that flies around and has sonic attacks and bombs, and Pearl's just like, oh, you know me so well. <laughs> And it's awesome. And it's awesome. Babe, I knew- Yeah, I guess that's pretty all right. Kiss me on the mouth right now. <laughs> Babe, I knew you would love so much to have an awesome robot body that can wreak destruction as much as you like. And Pearl's just like, yeah. Yeah, if we weren't already married, I'd take your hand in marriage right now. Let's get this show on the road. All right, so now we're gonna- Oh. Oh, oh, good doggy. Right, like a lot of the trailers and teaser stuff was like, you know, very deliberately hiding what this would be. So it's so people get the impression of like, oh, Marina is missing and maybe evil and Pearl has been trapped in some kind of robot body and it might be permanent. And it's like, no, 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 no. Marina made an oopsie. Pearl can be a person whenever she wants. She wants to be the murder robot. <laughs> it's good for her. It's enrichment. They 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 made another set of glasses that does bad things to your head and makes you evil. This time it was also a virtual boy, which is more fucked up than anything in the entire franchise. Uh, and so we saved her and it's just, I fucked up bad. We got to unplug the computer together. And you get to look at this guy. And she did just make little guys like this. Like, the, the the damn virtual boy on her head, they didn't even let her have, like, you know, Wario Land or whatever. All she had was Nestor's funky bowling. No matter, she was- it's no wonder she was lash, lashing out like that. Look at her fucking- look at her fishtail. Look at her steppies. Her Mr. Krabs ass walking. So good. Oh my god, pants guys are so small, I forgot. They're the size of a single pea. This fucking thing. Where are you going? Where are you going? All dressed up, somewhere to go. I gotta go on break. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, it's break time. All right. <laughs> Get a drink or a snack. It's just gonna be three minutes of ads, so you're not gonna be missing anything. We'll be back real soon. See you soon.
been here i just i just forgot to unmute <laughs> <laughs> hi hi you're back what did i eat N nothing i got more water i'm eating goldfish cracker dude that's the snack that smiles back it really is that's the I snack that hurts actually. you whenever it wants it really is that's the snack that gets you when you're not thinking about it it truly is it's the snack it is the snack. You're gonna have the snack today. So watch out. If you want. It's up to you, I guess. Mm -hmm. Give me just a sec. I have a bunch of notifications on Discord and I have to check if literally any of them are important. Uh... No. You always have to check, just in case. Uh, literally none of them are right now. It's okay. Yippee! Uh, so how about uh, I say thank you to Cherry Boomer for the 21 month resub? Why don't we do that? I'm loving this DLC so much. I'm addicted to Pearl Dream Goats. <laughs> I kill one bonus fish and she unleashes a missile barrage green screen effect upon the. Rest. I am a big fan of. I kill one boner fish. That's what they are. But I I love seeing that written out. I go out and I kill one boner fish. <laughs> it's good to do that. It's good to do that. Thank you for the resub. I appreciate it. You had a run where Pearl briefly became thermonuclear. Awesome. Um, there's one of the like weapon loadouts we're literally about to unlock right now at the start that has like a higher chance of getting you like Pearl drone uh chips. I'm going to save playing with that for later, even though it's my favorite of the starting weapons, because I want to spend more of, like, the permanent upgrades that let you put more shit on Pearl. <laughs> <laughs> so that I can do the move. Anyways, uh, let's, uh, let's take in the scenery a little bit now that we're done the tutorial. Featureless boxes. What? What is that? What is that PNG laying in there? Oh, you know, it's a sticker on the wall. Oh, it's a sticker in the window. I, I thought it was just a really poorly done PNG laying on the floor and was like, what the fuck? I did also kind of think that too. <laughs> Hang on, pants and the wall scuttler are like perfectly tied. Let's go. Dude, B Marina was like really off her gourd in a good way for this one where she's like, okay, so I need NPCs to populate my world. What do we do? Beautiful woman. Dog with pants on. Dog that can stick to the walls. But that's not and all. Cube. We can look at the others later because Marina really wants to talk about us, about how she loves the computer. <clears throat> hey, do you have a sec? Hey, you need to hear about my computer. I have a different, I have a different background, you know? It's another picture of Pearl, how'd you know? She's just, just got one of those slideshow backgrounds and it's all pictures of Pearl. Lord willing, that'll be me someday with you. Aww. <laughs> I've been running some scans. Somehow, Order jacked up the threat level in the Spire as high as it'll go. Why's it gotta go and do that? What's it mean for us? Well, for one thing, the spire is suddenly taller. But that's not the worst part. Run out of lives even once, and you die for real. That's not true, you don't die for real. Uh, and you'll get kicked out of the spire. And that'll probably happen since enemies hurt more. So what they don't tell you explicitly- We'll, we'll get to that, we'll get to yeah, that. Yeah. Don't you worry. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah, I'm seeing some challenges here. <laughs> that said, I built the members to begin with. I don't have to take this sitting down. Now that I'm outside the spire, I can hack the system, overwrite the changes, and lower the difficulty. Oh, you can do all that? Glad you have you back on our side. Thing is, 
I'll need pearls to get any hacking done. Marina made a special currency for special upgrades that you can do to make yourself stronger that she didn't finish implementing. So she's got to have like this hacky setup solution to get them working. And she named the, the meta currency after her fucking wife. If you bring me wife bucks after every run, you will get stronger. Power of wife makes you stronger. Also, yeah, I'm really glad that they, like, have the fucking, uh, like, new outfits they made up for, like, the promo renders that they just get to wear in their models now. It's good. It's good. Oh, they look so good. It look literally looks so good. I want a look fucking outfit suit. like this. The fucking... The striped pants. It's such a look. It's so good. The, the matching open blazer with, like, the, 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 the halter top. Mm -hmm. The matching headphones. Mm -hmm. It's the fucking headphones are so good. I wish I had a set of headphones like that. Oh, God willing, one day. But you should have some pearls already, I think. There you go. Those pearls were generated when you came out of the spire. Every time you leave, your color chips and mem bucks will automatically be converted into pearls. So, like, we're probably gonna bite it in the spire, but if we kick some butt first, we get more pearls? And giving pearls to Marina for hacks to make it easier will help us next time! Even losing helps us win! I like this plan! Here are the settings I've figured out how to hack so far. Want me to fix anything in your favor? So... Once again, I am rewarded infinitely for reading every single bit of text in the video game. Uh, mm -hmm. Where, you, you know, you see max lives, damage reduction, max armor, broken armor, etc, etc. You got a couple to pick from at the start, you get a bunch more as time goes on. Damage reduction. Reduces damage taken. You'll notice that at the start of the video game, after the tutorial, it says you are taking times two damage. Right out the gate, you are taking double damage. And I was like, damn, yeah, it's kind of wild uh, how that you're just taking like a flat 2x damage right at the start of the video game, huh? And I say this in a couple group chats and multiple people in both of, the, in, like, both of these group chats just go, Oh, oh, I didn't see that. That explains a couple things. <laughs> they They do say, you know, you only have one life and you're taking more damage than in the tutorial. They, they don't. They, this is how you see you're taking double damage. <laughs> Read everything in the video game, no matter what. I'm buying a life. Get hacking. Oh, yeah. Also, look at her little Squid Sister sticker on the laptop. It's really cute, yeah. Even you'd have a hard time getting to the new top of the Spire 8. But my hacks should smooth the way. Glad you can turn the upgrades off later if you want to hurt. I do appreciate... There's there's a couple things we'll see eventually. One thing I do know of is there's an upgrade you can get that is specifically the fewer hacks you have active, and you can turn to flip them off. You can choose to flip them off. The fewer hacks you have active, the more pearls you get from a run. But if you have that hack active... There's, like, some condition, I think, where, like, you also, like, can lose out on a bunch of pearls if you fuck up. Or something like that. So it's, mm -hmm. it's, it's, it's the gambler's choice. You want to get spicy with it? Yeah, there's lots of interesting, like, risk-reward type deals that we'll get into as we go further into this. Mm -hmm. You don't get any if you lose? Okay, that's what it is. Thank you. It's, you have to win. You have to win, and you get a bunch of extra for playing hard mode. But you have to win. And that's and that's fun because uh, going through the tutorial, I was very much like, "This is very easy." And going through like a couple of the runs I did, it was like, "Wow, I'm getting pretty close to the end." And like, aside from me like making some really fucking bad decisions, uh, this is relatively straightforward and not super super difficult so far. I did also pick a weapon that I really like that is relatively safe as well. But uh, it's mm. it's it's cool to know that you can upgrade the heat to your to your to your liking in multiple ways. 
Uh, there's also, if you're if you're struggling, there are things you can do to make it easier. We'll see once we lose our first run, there's an option to just, like, start again from the floor you died on in case you just really want to try getting to the end kind of thing. It's cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is a very robust and interesting and fun to play around with game mode. They got options. They got shit for perverts like me, so I'm happy. That's the best Th I can do for This is a little here. bit the pervert, the pervert DLC. In, like, the hallway of the work. I know what you mean! <laughs> I'm just it's doing a goof! DLC. I'm just doing a goof! <laughs> <sighs> That's the best I can do from here. It'll be up to you to put a stop to order. Yeah, just uh, one more thing. Here, hey, I have pallet for you. So, every palette has, like, colored chips that you're more likely to get. I think the pearl one, the most likely one you get is, like, luck and then, uh, like, utility or something like that. Marina's palette is the shotgun with a shield, where the most <laughs> likely chip you are to get is make pearl stronger. And the second most likely you are to get is make yourself stronger. Get power! It's really good. So this is the one for Holly. So we're not going to be using it quite right away, because I want to spend more pearls on uh, pearl upgrades first, but... Eventually I'm going to bust out Epic Wife Gun and kind of kind of chow down a little. Mm -hmm. One of those things color chips go into? Didn't know you had your own. This with 0% shot spread? Oh god, Sebmal. I had to tune out of your stream when you were talking about that. I don't know if you ended up getting it. The, the fucking- the play- the move that I got... The umbrella with faster recharging shield, piercing shots, <laughs> piercing shots that go through enemies to hit other enemies and then increase damage and then poison. And I was looking at one of the fucking like bits of flavor text on the back of the chips. One of them mentions sticky ink. I've never <laughs> seen that one yet. I want it. I want it bad. I want it bad. I want to shoot out my fucking bumper shield that leaves a trail behind it that everyone gets stuck in and takes damage in, and then I let out one fucking shot and it blows up all of them. I want it. <laughs> I think that was the run that specifically made you go, Hey, honey, would you be up to moving this... this the stream up a little bit. Yes, it was. Literally, that's what made me go, I need to play more of this shit. Do you want to stream this? <laughs> <laughs> the, the fucking, the base gameplay of Splatoon fits really fucking good into a format like this. I'm pumped. Mm -hmm. I don't remember. Did we read this line? <laughs> I, I did. I did. Okay. Setting this palette to your drone, I, I, I mean, Pearl, We'll let you use an, a new weapon. I did some research, and this doesn't seem to be the only other palette in the members. My early scans of those lockers over there show signs of other palettes inside. When you saved me, I found myself with some keys for those lockers. You should have them, mate. Three keys. Oh, but you can't change palettes while climbing the spire. If you want to switch, Make sure to press plus before getting in the elevator. So, there are different weapon loadouts. By the way, Marina's diary. We can read Marina's diary. We're gonna do that in a sec. Her extremely rainbow colored diary. Her really normal diary. Hey, what the- Yo, Marina, it's your diary. Shouldn't you keep this under lock and key? Oh. Wait, I guess you kind of did. Oh. Well... Uh, maybe it's for the best. It's a little embarrassing, but... If you two want to read it, feel free. You sure, Rina? I've got to leave this with you, wait. If you want to read it, you can do that from the menu on X. Pearl immediately just being like, 
I don't want to read your fucking diary. That's weird. I mean, I guess you can do it if you want. If she's okay with it. I'm not fucking doing that. <laughs> Here's the banner. Hey, a banner. They put all kinds of stuff in these. We have to get this open anymore. Another pallet. Agent Forest Gun. pallet. What in the world? This is Agent Forest pallet. Oh? Oh, yeah! Agent Four! Who was that again? One of the new Squid Beak Splatoon members that Captain Cuttlefish introduced us to. Oh, yeah! One who was supposed to be such a big shot. Uh, what's Agent Four's palette doing here? <laughs> who the fuck was that? Oh, right, the one from Splatoon 2. Okay. Why are we, they here? We were goofing last night. <laughs> like, yeah, original Agent 3, like, is a full on shonen hero now running the Squid Beak Splatoon. Agent 8 is getting in all kinds of situations, best friends with Marina and Pearl. New Agent 3, like, went to space, had a whole big thing. Agent 4 is studying. Agent 4 went to school. <laughs> He's Agent 4. They're really cool and they're really strong and they're, um, going to college, I guess. See you later. <laughs> <laughs> Agent 4, aka Miss Not Appearing in this film. Respect. <laughs> the Gohan of Splatoon! Yeah! <laughs> A Agent 4 is gonna reappear in, like, the Battle of the Strongest Warriors and just be like, yeah, I got time off for my desk job uh, to be here. Is that cool? <laughs> she comes in, like, a fucking suit and tie. <laughs> She's got a briefcase. <laughs> Yeah, I'm an office worker now. It's cool. I still, you know, do 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 some turf wars on weekends sometimes for the exercise. Agent Four gets hired by Captain Three to like do the desk job work, and it's just like, this is what I got my degree for. This is what I've been training for. <laughs> Marie's shunting off all her work onto them. <laughs> it's working. What would the Saiya Man version of Agent 4 be? I don't know enough about Dragon Ball to know what that is, so you're gonna have to ask <laughs> someone else. By the way, well, palettes are actually a representation of a part of someone's soul. Just souls straight up- Souls are real and they're just in here. Well, souls are, souls are real and that's how you respawn, and also a chunk of them is now stuck in the, the computer world. And by the way, souls are real and we're pulling them in here. I guess Order somehow pulled a part of Agent Four's soul into the members, turning it into a pallet. What, for real? Man, we better keep this with us. Wouldn't mind anything happening to it. I'm still getting signals from other pallets in the lockers. Let's keep opening them as we find keys. And by the way, multiple souls are trapped in these lockers and we have to get them out. Oh no, Agent Four isn't dead! Because we have parts of Pearl and Marina's souls as well, and they're fine. A Agent Four is just taking a nap and or has a chunk of their soul missing without them realizing. It's fine. It's fine. It's okay. A Agent Four's fine. They're just spacing out at their office job right now. <laughs> it's not great, but they'll be all right. The chips. We gotta look at the chips. All right, yeah. Also, if you look at your chips, you get bonus pearls. Do this after oh, I meant Oh, I meant the other chips. <laughs> What? In the studio. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> so there's just a bag of chips here! The chips are okay! She programmed in a bag of chips and just left them in the studio! <laughs> she she was making little items to just have around the set. You know, she has her, her DJ set. She's got her, her the little posters of the two of them. They've got the, the, the little logo. It's a little bleached out, but it's still okay. There's just a bag of chips! One single bag of chips. There's just a bag of chips! <laughs> On Pearl's side, yeah! <laughs> chips for her wife! Pupy. Oh, Pupy Doogie. Uh, the bakery don't got nothing. No foods in it. That's too bad. Oh, we do need to look at the weird horse, though. We do need to take a peek at that duck. Now it, now it is a duck. It is a duck with a saddle, but it is a duck. Oh, that's creature. It's 
pretty good duck. You ever seen a duck like this? Now you have. Look at it looking skyward, bold and beautiful. It's a good duck. You can't believe there's nothing where the Octo Expansion entrance was? That was like here, right? Yeah, that that's the other subway line. Please stay tuned to when we beat the video game and see the credits. Smile. Oh, yeah, so I got more pearls. So, I'm going to spend that on damage reduction. Uh, and the, the, oh, wait, there we go. One more action slot. Cool. We can put more things in Pearl now. Is that good? She likes it. She thinks it's cool. More bombs. Okay, and now the lobby is a play place. Oh, they made it a McDonald's play place in here! All of the different objects that you can see in levels, you can touch them. You have to pick your palette here. Make sure you have the palette you want. I'm just gonna stick with the dualies for now. Oh, the, the light again. coming in. That's cool. Yeah, Look yeah. at that. that That's orange. scary. They, they, they really like the like washed out pink and like a lot of other places. And then like some of the bits, you get like much more like fiery orange lighting. It's good. It's good. Is this rogue like Splatoon? Yes. It sure is. Yes, it is. Uh, it's neat. I like it. Let's go. I I like when you approach and like the 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 big squares appear. It's good. Mm -hmm. I guess it only did it once, but still good. It's By the way, good. you can go back here and you can replay uh, the tutorial if you want. And wait. oh dear God, that's the Virtual Boy controllers, huh? Yep. Uh. It's just straight up Virtual Boy controller strapped to her headset. She was just stuck in a Virtual Boy. She was just stuck in a Virtual Boy. Uh, shoutouts to Seb Mall, who I can actually do a proper shoutout to now because the time has passed. Uh, uh, I'm gonna make sure I type it right. <laughs> I was gonna say. There we go. Uh, who is the reason why I even noticed it was a fucking Virtual Boy uh, <laughs> on that stream. This time I have shouted out Seb AML. What does Seb Man think about this stream? <laughs> I gotta know. Inquiring minds need to know. We go. Hi, Oct. Hi, Oct. And now Marina's in the elevator. Listen, the going might be tough ahead, but if we don't give up, I know we can make it. You know it! Let's get this party started! Don't worry about me. I'm in this to the end. Hey! The pallet's all empty! My oh, poison! Yeah, because all the color chips you had got converted into pearls. No color chips, no upgrades. You also have fewer lives than you did before, right? Is Deadfish locked in the elevator uh, by their own choice because they have an injury that is not healing no more. So they're mm -hmm. staying in here so they don't die. So be careful. If you lose all your lives, you'll be thrown out of the spire and have to start all over again. If you, if you lose all your lives, the, the foppish boy king will slam his hand on the throne and demand you begin again. That's fucked. Hmm. Hmm. I kind of want to go for a lucky build because we get a lot of lucky drops from this from this loadout. Turf might, might building up lucky the build. lucky chain sounds really good, but I really am going to need to have literally anything uh, to like bank that luck onto something. So I don't know if I should start with this or if I should go for the disc drop and get a lot more money out of it. Mm. Um, I'm gonna go for this because it's more money. Go there. Mm. 
Yeah, wish a bone. I'm really happy with the talk sprites. Puzz just fucking knocked them out out of nowhere today and was like, by the way, I made new ones for you. <laughs> I really wanted to. I, I was actually going to do them uh, last Look night the right pattern. after you, you got off call, but Look at the ink pattern. my cat. Oh, that's so pretty. It's got rings in it now. Oh. But yeah, I was gonna do them last night after you signed up. I was like, I should do some sprites if we're gonna if we're gonna do it tomorrow. And then immediately, as I thought that, my cat came and laid down on my arms for like oh, an hour. The napper. <laughs> I I literally wasn't expecting you to make anything at all, and you came up to me and you were like, Oh, I'm sorry. I was only able to do like such and such. I can only do so much with the free time well, I, I had. Wanted to make them I wanted to match the, the Splatoon style like I did with the old ones, and I don't know, it takes longer to do like a lineless style like that and do all hey, the Hey, that 2% things. is putting it work! <laughs> yeah, hey, right hey! Right start, huh? Okay, alright, loud and clear. Puzz, Puzz had like this whole sad, heartfelt thing, like, I'm really sorry. Uh, I don't have time to, you know, make them, like, matching and lineless like the other ones, and I was just like, oh, hon, I love you. I don't know what that means. <laughs> Wait! Oh, I failed. It's over. Uh-oh! I got cocky. Okay, damn, level one. I gotta not do that. I should have just gone up more, but I was like, it'll be fast if I squeeze by them! It's fine. This is why you got an extra life. Yep. Dude, they, they did get me with the succulent bite. That's on me. I hear that disc dropping again. <laughs> Let's uh, get out of here. Shit. Goodbye. It's that easy. It's that easy. Just don't fuck up. Simply win. The antenna are the legs of the virtual boy used to stand oh! on a desk? That's really fucking good. <laughs> okay. Increases the duration of a lucky chain? Yes. It's an it's an easy one, but that's really good for me. That's really good for me, that'll make it more consistent, and then later I can worry about making it bigger. I'm going for luck build, because that sounds fun to me. And now we have delicious mustard. Delicious honey mustard. Eating a burger with no honey mustard. Can't be doing that. Eating a burger with no honey mustard. Eating a burger with no honey mustard. You just sit there eating a burger with no honey mustard. Eating a burger with no honey mustard. Eating a burger with no honey mustard. This damn dog's away from my ball! Oh, hates the ball. Nice. Alright. Drone battery drop. Let's get a killer whale on her first and then, uh, worry about... Well, actually, no. We'll... Let's go for the battery drop first and then. And then. And then. And then. If we get more batteries to appear, then we can take more advantage of her power. And then we'll let her scream. Oh, it's balls again! A ball stream, let's go! I'm looking at my ball stream. Do you like it? Do you like it? Is that okay? Is it ethical? I mean, it's definitely not ethical, but it's probably good. Okay. No! They can bite it when it's about to go in! It's fine. It's fine. Check this out. My strat. My strat. I'm literally the genius of gaming. I'm literally the genius of gaming. It's that easy. Okay. Green ass palette. The damage dealt by sound waves from the killer whale, wave breaker, or pearl drone. Interesting. 
damage dealt with your main weapon shots to nearby targets. That ah. could be good for the dualies. Yes, I will take it, actually. Yes, I will. Yummy, yummy. Okay. I didn't know there was a close range damage chip. All right. Yahoo. <laughs> Let's go. You're starting to get, like, the hero mode coloring. It's fun. Whee. Can increase the drone gauge, just doesn't do anything yet. Which is funny. Mm -hmm. That's probably gonna happen for a bit till I can get her a power up. There we go. Alright, I don't have dodge roll damage on right now. <laughs> I forgot! I have no idea if the damage increase applies to hitting the tower or not. I don't quite know if it calculates damage or if it just calculates based on the fact that you're hitting it. It's good. Go, 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 that easy? I mean, I guess it was an easy one, wasn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we got some damage up. That's good. Uh, rush attack, which increases Reef Slider, which we do have. Lucky Bomb Drop. Rigorous. Oh, we're getting rigorous already? Let's get rigorous. They haven't even explained that to us yet. No, ri rigorous is not a thing they explain. It's just a difficulty. The, uh, the it, be, getting rigorous is not connected to the other thing. Oh, okay. I, I conflated the two because we had it happen at the same time when we were playing yesterday. Yep. I conflated it for a while too, and then I saw other people get rigorous without the thing. All right, that's one. We get some ink back. Oh, I guess by default, enemies do take some little bit of damage in your ink. Like, they're taking hundreds. I guess that makes sense. Kind of similar to PvP. Mm -hmm. Well, you don't take damage in that, you just get slowed and don't need to regen. I think. Mm -hmm. No, it's gonna despawn, it's fine. Actually, it's fine forever. I, like, it's literally- I'm literally wasting time by getting it, but it's funny. So... Open up! The batteries! I need them! They don't do anything yet! <laughs> but my pickups! It does damage in PvP? I always just thought it was like it slows you down and you don't regen as fast. I didn't realize it was also hurting you. Damn, all these years. Noise! We made it past 5F! And we got pearls for clearing it. The spire's set up to give you some good bonuses if you can clear 5F. For example, if you get kicked out after that, you'll start with 500 mem bucks on your next run. And there'll be a guaranteed vending machine corner on 5F where you can spend it. A oh, vending machine corner sounds like a great place to take a breather. Not that I breathe. <laughs> she has forgotten about the real world. She's gonna get out of the computer and forget she's gotta use her lungs. <laughs> she's gonna, like, jump off a third story building trying to fly. <laughs> <laughs> It's worth your while to get past 5F on every run if you can. Well, don't stop there! Let's make this THE run where we reach order and blast it to bits! You feel me, eight? Oh, I'm feeling- Kill! 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 kill, kill. Stick! It's time. No, because Killer Whale. Oh, how could they do this to you? 
I'm gonna go for the whale. Man, man, I wish it wasn't giving me sticky ink now. <laughs> man! It's okay, it's okay. You also get to see the wheelie guys here. We do get to see the wheelie guys at least. And like now we have the power of the whale, so we literally have a use for the batteries that we're generating fairly often. Oh, okay. it's this one! It's this one. We got this one last night, right? Yeah. Guys, this is gonna be really funny. Watch this. Well, it helps if I don't miss. Guys, this is gonna be really funny. Check this out. Check this out. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. No, no, it's gonna be really funny. Just keep watching. These rude motherfuckers. Stay there! Literally, stay there! It's that easy! <laughs> See? I told you it'd be funny! You gotta laugh out loud! <laughs> it's, it's that easy every time! Holly always wins. I'm not really having difficulty getting uh, my specials back or up. So I'm gonna go for sticky ink. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> we take it. We take it. We literally She always take it. wins! I'm I'm winning so good today. I've never had trouble in my life. I've never had an issue. Defeat the fleeing foes. You must look out for fleeing foes. It just shit a bomb out onto the floor. Like, not onto the floor, like, into the pit! <laughs> it got too scared! It did get too scared and cause a problem. They all went down here! Only one bomb landed <laughs> on the terrain. Okay. Check this out. They're actually awesome. Yes, coming to the shredder. Nothing will happen. They do like just standing in my pain zones, which is really funny. Yeah! <laughs> Let's go! I should buy um the the <laughs> the thing that lets me get <laughs> uh <laughs> canned specials oh, let's see I'm not really using my sub super much and even when I am it's it's fine the amount of ink it uses I guess I'm not really going for explosions I guess range isn't bad Can't and it's his own more range more range ain't so bad. You can eventually buy with pearls a reroll for like your floors. Mm -hmm. um, and I'm looking forward to that so that I can just go. No, I want a different one. Okay, so what's in there? It is more ink. It's in here. It is special. Here's what we'll do. Get that, so I have that ready. Oh right, the fucking the flyers that flood everywhere. I always forget yeah, about them till it's too late. Get my zone back. My ink. Uh, I want ink saver main really bad. <laughs> is the problem. Mm -hmm. Take out this. Ouch! Okay, run over. Damn. Ooh! I keep thinking... This, this is the problem. I keep thinking that I have power-ups from previous runs that I don't have. So I keep going, yep. okay, I can just dodge roll into these dudes and tackle them. No, I don't have that one this run! <laughs> 
And I keep thinking that I have multiple dodge rolls, but you don't have that on the, on the doolies in this. My fucking memory of other things in this video game is fucking me up, but I got 50 pearls. You did get 50 pearls. I got 50 pearls. I got 15 pearls. I got 65 pearls. <laughs> Yippee! Dude, do you get any for looking at the bestiary also? You get titles. <laughs> nice, we're a beta tester. Also, you can touch these and they make sounds. Again, this is the DLC of touching stuff and it makes sounds happen. For example. There's so much sounds you can make. I love sounds. We we did get a little sloppy pearl, that's true. <laughs> that run was on me. Uh, right, you can start you can start from the floor where you ended if you want to do the run back, like immediately like that. I'm okay with not doing that. I'm okay with playing normal. Uh, but you can get faster armor recovery. That is ten pearls for that. Yes. I take it. Uh, I would like double chip rate up because more chips means more happy. Way. Um, Membox reward. More Membox is a reward for clearing floors. More bucks translates into more pearls, which means more happy. Way. Oh, does it cost pearls to restart a run? I didn't know it had a cost like that. Okay. I, I assumed it was just a, like, you can use this to help you out if you want it type feature. I guess that makes sense that it has a cost. Mm -hmm. That that That's interesting, too, because then it's like, okay, if you get real deep in and have have a sloppy run, it's like, well, I'd like to go back to where I was. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and okay. I've got the money to, to be worth that. <laughs> so we can get a mine for Pearl and a sprinkler for Pearl and a burst bomb for Pearl. And then we can get more slots so we can fit more of those into Pearl in one run. Cool. Again. I'm gonna go for the doolies again. I'm gonna go for the doolies again. No, I'm going to go for the doolies again! <laughs> Aside from me being real sloppy, that was a good run. Oh, nice! Since we cleared 5F in our last run, this time we get 500 mem bucks off the bat! That works out well. I remember you saying there's a guaranteed vending machine corner on 5F to spend it. So once we get to 5F, we can take 5! Yeah, that'll give us a good head start. Let's make the most of it, 8! Yay! Right. Yippee! Drone gauge charge. Lucky chain window again. Yep. <laughs> We're going, for the, we're going for the- Look luck. at Marina's little crouch, it's cute! Mm hmm her squat. Oh god, and in heels too. Girl, you're strong. Something is wrong with her, and I mean that with nothing but respect. Oh, extremely. Is Pearl a robot now? So this is the computer world, um, and it's virtual reality, and Marina specifically made a cool robot body for Pearl to use whenever she wants, and Pearl has decided she wants to use it. She can literally turn back into normal person whenever she wants. She has decided she doesn't want to, which is really funny. <laughs> Got him. Great. Well, don't mind if I do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sure. I don't mind if I do. I don't mind if I do. Don't mind. If I do. That got scary. I missed. Oh well. That would have been so cool if I didn't miss. Mm -hmm. I don't think it would have been cool, but it would have been something. <laughs> My window bigger. Um, disc piece drop. Yes. 
now that the chain is more. Um, damage is nice, but it's just like 5% more. Which is good, but I want more luck. I want more luck, so I'm gonna take more luck. You love Eight's pathetic virgin walk back to the elevator? Don't say that! <laughs> Don't <laughs> call it that! <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Spange. Okay, hey, hey. Spange. Okay, right, they can hurt. They can bite and hurt Spange. Duh. They love to do that. Keep forgetting Spanned. my dodge roll! Beware the biter! Okay, let's just go for it. Damn, it went all the way, all the way, huh? Yeah, it loves to explode. Like that! Okay. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine! Oh, that guy was close, close! <laughs> that biter was close, close! <laughs> well, it's all okay. You won! That's what counts. Mm-hmm. Inking the ground adds to the lucky chain, or I could go for the battery again. On on a, on levels with high enemy density, uh, getting the chain up has been fine. This is good if we don't experience that. And we don't currently have anything for the drone yet, so I'm gonna go for this. And then try and fish for the bomb upgrade. Or the lucky bomb upgrade. More. Sink the balls! They're always saying this. They are always saying this. Go! Hi, boo boo balls. I, I like this specific color of like, kind of like dull red flooring because it makes it look like a YMCA. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen a YMCA colored like this. I should be doing after school sports here. I it it does feel a little bit gym floor though, doesn't it? It does! That's what I'm saying! <laughs> Alright. Again with the turf lucky chain! <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I gotta go for dodge roll attack. It's needed badly. It's needed, it's needed badly. So badly. It's needed badly. Uh, refill ink by defeat. Oh. Hmm. I'm gonna want that one later, but this one's needed badly. This one's needed badly. Killing gets ink back is pretty fucking good sounding, though. Okay. Don't mind if I do later, but not yet. Don't mind if I eventually. Oh, these bastards. Nasty motherfuckers. Top man, you lout! I'm making my awful zone! You'll leave it! <laughs> leave! Get out! Leave the fucking floor now! Well, they Fuck sure did. Thank you so much. Oh, check it out, eh? Vending machine. Vending machine corner. Want to get a soda and kick back for a bit? I don't know if I do. Oh, these don't sell drinks. But for a few mem bucks, you can restock lives or buy color chips. 
Some even let you swap your sub-weapon or special weapon for a new one. Also, a vending machine corner counts as a floor. So, if you hit one off, that's one less risk you take on your way up the spire. Solid arguments all around. So what you say, eh? Wanna see what it's got? I kind of want to get more Lucky Chain Window, actually. <laughs> like, I could go here and maybe get something good, or I could get the thing that I see here that I know is what I want. And you get to go see Boo Boo Wheel. We do get to see Boo Boo Wheel, and that's just a plus, so. <laughs> and, like, we still get the pearls, and we still get the guaranteed uh, fountain on the next run if we want to. This that cool ass device that. in the background. That sure. Oh my god, it's like hamster tubes. You can see something moving in it. Yeah, it is, huh? That's fun. <laughs> god, look at the low poly parrot fish, too. That dude is having so much fun. He's got it all figured out. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> this is gonna be really funny. <laughs> oh, I thought it was gonna go for the, for the other one, like, right away. That would have been funny. If only. Okay, there's still a chance. Ha! The flinger. Let's get out of biting corner. Okay, so we just had one biter. Or one top. We burst this so that we have a big zone. Big, big killing you zone. Hey man, would you love to get stuck in my bad area? Would you love to get stuck in my bad area? It's that easy. Well, it's I got one of them easy. with the top, so that's pretty good. Yeah, that I, was pretty funny. I thought I was gonna respawn. I thought it was gonna respawn. Oh, right. Humphead Brass. That's right, those two do look kind of similar. Two. Fucking yes, please. You fucking bet I'm taking two, Lucky Bomb. Are you kidding me? Lucky. Lucky. Thirty percent might as well mean all the time with a dense enough crowd of enemies. Mm -hmm. It might as well be forever. It might as well be the rest of my fucking life. See? <laughs> Look! Lucky! <laughs> it's fine. Oh, damn. Okay, all the way across already. Give me more enemies! Let me blow up more guys! Make it harder! What do you mean the normal level's just normal difficulty? That's fucked! that specific um, tower level so many times. Huh? Do we get something the next draw on the next floor? Bonus. Ah! You found a bonus floor! On floors like this, you either get a color chip saturation or a bonus challenge. A color chip saturation sets color chips to all empty slots in your palette. Only for that floor, though. The colored chips you get are randomly picked. All they have in common is their tone. Whereas a bonus challenge gives you an extra objective separate from the main one on the floor. You don't have to do it, but if you do, it'll earn you some bonus map box! Not seeing a downside here! What do you think, Gate? Wanna give it a go? I've never done any of these, because every time I've gotten one, it's been for a chip I didn't want. Finally, I am vindicated. Finally, I am vindicated. <laughs> Finally, I get bonus. Give us the scream. Give me the bonus. Let's get a bonus. Let's go. Launching pyramid. 
Mobility! Okay! Wow, we're fast! <laughs> oh, they gave us movement! Got a speed, Keed! Yeah, this saturation stuff is pretty neat, huh? Mm hmm Give me the- give me the- There we go. <laughs> I just wanna, okay, well, off we go! Goodbye! Later, haters. They're just dropping dead in, like, my fucking bad ink, and it's making my chain go up! <laughs> The, the drone chip bonus levels seem like they go fucking wild, uh, given some of the shit you can give to Pearl. Mm-hmm. Bonus instance, of, okay, Pearl, kill. Okay. I think I want the battery drop, because given that I'm going for maximum luck, that's kind of a little bit equivalent to her whale coming out more anyways. Mm-hmm. Oh, look at this blue and, like, Green, yellow, that's fun. Mm -hmm. Best run? Technically, on this save. <laughs> Destroy the portals. Hey, what's in here? Yeah, sure, I'll take it from the start. Oh, I didn't have my super ready. I thought I had it full. I'm a fool! My hubris! Uh -oh. I was like, this is gonna be so cool, my meter's full. It wasn't full. I got it halfway full. I forgot it's not a complete fill. I am the history's greatest fool. Well, let's play this smart this time. That's fine. I can recover. That's fine. I can recover. Ooh, nice one. That's fine. I can recover. Check this out. You're gonna love it. that easy. Simply don't make a bad mistake like I did, and it's that easy. Alright, one more before our first boss. I have to go for the poison. Like, the sound wave damage is nice, but the poison challenge. I, I literally need to take the poison challenge. She, she has to take the poison challenge? I, yeah. I literally need to take the poison challenge. If, if gotta I gotta have a poison challenge. I just have to beat this floor and the boss and then the vending machine will probably have an extra life for me to buy. Besides, it's protecting the zone so having my ink be the poison challenge will help in protecting the zone. Mm -hmm. okay, let's take a special fill up to start. It's not too bad if you remember the funny flying guy is gonna come in. Yep. Just gotta make sure you find him and take him out. Yeah, nuts. Weird angle on that one. Yeah, and I didn't get the flying guy like I wanted to. I was hoping the, the curling bomb would taste him a little more. It's okay.
Remember, you don't have to just camp the zone. You can move up. You should move up. Just like in- just like in Splat Zones. To some degree, you should also be playing forward, not just holding back. The game mode. Assess your situation. Heads up. There's something on the next floor way past anything we've fought so far. Brace yourselves. If this spire kept anything from my original design, then there should be a boss at 10F. Selene for a real fight, huh? Stay on your toes, Aiden. Don't push your luck. Alright. Let's see what boss we got. Yeah, this is gonna be exciting because you and I have only seen two of them. After oh, a break. Geez, yeah, it's great. <laughs> Why did she put boss fights in the computer? Because specifically, this is the oh shit, things are scary and fucked up module. This is the oh man, we gotta tussle because things are weird in here module. This is the, the, the one with boss fights module that she made. <laughs> you should see the other one she made. It's called Trouble in Terrorist Town. We have to find who the traitor is. <laughs> Alright, get up, have a stretch, get a drink. Get a snack if you haven't eaten in a while. Uh, I'm just running ads for three minutes, so you're not missing anything. We'll be back real soon. See you shortly. You know what time it is. 
Oh, baby, you know what time it is. That's right. It's time for me to sit down in a chair. How's the chair? Uh, it's fine. It's not super comfortable, but it's not uncomfortable. So it's 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 sturdy. Uh, it's reliable. It's not a swivel chair, so it doesn't feel like it's going to just explode and collapse on me someday. Um, and I'm sitting in it. Oh, baby, she's sitting. I'm going to take a big fucking drink. It's good to do this. You had a honey mustard craving after I mentioned it. <laughs> Eating a burger with no honey mustard. <laughs> Eating a burger with no honey mustard. Eating a burger with no honey mustard. Eating a burger with no honey mustard. I have to resize the talk sprite again. <laughs> <laughs> That's about where it was, I think. Uh, bigger. She should be bigger. There we go. Okay. Uh, video game? Video game. Video game? Video game. Video game. Video game. Go I there. I wonder who it will be today. Which video game will we encounter today? I hope it's Super Mario. Dude, an animal is getting tummy rubs live? Oh no! No! <laughs> no! <laughs> It's your chance, honey! Redeem yourself! I genuinely think this is the scariest fucking boss you can get as your first boss. Like, first in your whole time playing the DLC, not like first in a run. When you have minimal upgrades! Uh... <laughs> these guys are a little scary, but I mean, I've got the poison challenge. So... Be brave! So, so you know how they were talking about how uh, the computer was taking other people's souls and trapping them in the in the machine? Well, time to fight them. So do you think these are other players, or...? Oh yeah, this is a real live being. They're, they're alive just like you and me. Right. Anyway, fight to kill. Ooh. Ooh. You, you cut that out, my bomb now. Huge fucking splashdown! Missed. Oh well. Okay, you laid down some cover. One, I love that you can roll into them with the damage roll. That feels good. Mm -hmm. What if my luck increase? What if my math increase? Get rid of this so it's out of the way. Get away from the bomb. Get rid of the blaster. Who's left? Two ah! out there somewhere. You got one out there somewhere. I'm going to full body tackle you! The brother. Wipe out! <laughs> okay. Well, actually not so bad with this build. I changed my mind. <laughs> oh, honey, that was beautiful. Actually, this fight's for chumps. I changed my mind. <laughs> this is a baby fight. It's easy. So this was the first one we ran into when we were playing yesterday. Th this was the first boss I saw in this game that was not Marina, and I was just like, oh, what the fuck? I got to the third phase and got my asshole handed to me. <laughs> ah! I did not have the power of football tackle because I was using the Brella. <laughs> but now uh -huh. I just have the full body tackle, so... And now we get to go to the vending machine. Vending machine. Everyone still in one piece? Sweet! What the fuck even was that? Definitely stronger than any gelatin we've seen. 
What did you pick up at the end? A, a locker key? That's interesting. Based on this, I think you'll get a key every time you clear certain floors for the first time with each pallet. So, you have to beat every boss in a run with every weapon to get keys. That's that's the gameplay loop. That's that's the meta progression loop. Is you go and you beat a run with all your weapons so you can unlock more things to keep doing more runs to unlock more things. And by doing that, you get more pearls to get more power-ups to power up future runs so you can beat future runs so you can get more keys to unlock more stuff. It's one of them games. So if we clear 10F again with another pallet, we get another key? Exactly, Pearl. That said, I don't think we've rung this pallet dry of keys yet. Yeah, I expect we'll find more as we take this one further along. Alright. Now here's the thing. <laughs> Vending machine. But... Pearl Splat Bomb. You could just give her bombs. But Pearl Splat Bombs. But Pearl Splat Bombs. <laughs> My wife does like to live dangerously. Plus, if we wipe this run, all of our money is getting converted into a shit ton of pearls. So... That's... that's fine. Oh, right, I only have one life left. I thought I had two. You do not. That's part of why we were thinking about going to the vending machine, to maybe buy a life. <laughs> oh, yeah. Well... It's fine. I got luck power. You do have luck power. Where's the flutter? Where's the flutter? Where's the flutter? My zone? It's back? It's that easy? It's that easy? <laughs> Just get the lucky drop? And a whale. Just get the lucky drop. It stops them from spawning. What's the problem? I, I like that your build this run has turned into what if Pearl was the luckiest, strongest little princess in all the land. She does deserve it is the thing. <laughs> she does. It's that easy. It's that easy. It's literally that easy. <laughs> Rigorous, my ass. It's that easy. <laughs> yeah, the marriage DLC prophecies did come true, didn't they? <laughs> <laughs> Hooray! L listen, once we get out of this run and get a shit ton of pearls and I'm pumping them all into the drone, I'm, I'm taking up the umbrella and we're doing the marriage run. Yippee! Alright, more battery drop. Uh, I think I want more battery drop. More more lucky chain is nice, but I'm able to keep the chain pretty consistently. So let's just get more goodies out of it. It's an easy floor, but I mean, listen, ain't ain't no shame in taking an easy ap after after some of the floors we've been through. Yeah, but I like it when it's hard. <laughs> I know. Sink the balls, though. Sink the balls. Featuring the top men. Oh my god, the top men are here, aren't they? See? Even though it's easy, it'll be fun. There's balls and tops. Well, don't know if the top men are fun. Really? Okay, fuck the up. I'm just gonna... Let's go down. It's so fun, look at them, they're spinning around. They, they sure fucking are. They're having a fun ha! time ball! spinning. This is the power of ball. Hey bro, let's talk about it. You don't have to fight. Oh my god, the ball can- I didn't realize it could nudge those! It's cuteness! Wee! And... 
it's that easy. Him. Where did it? You bitch! Bitch ass motherfucker! You're the worst guy of my life, and you rebounded off of the guys I needed to hit. Pearl, don't use the beam on the ball. What's that? Use the beam on the ball? What is she doing? <laughs> Why did she do that? She's drunk with power. She can kill any. All right, all right. Oh. <laughs> Why was she doing that? <laughs> Helping. Literally so helpful. Huh? Someone's funky up with the next floor. Ah, they're introducing hard mode. Danger. Danger. Yeah, there's danger there. <laughs> Whatever happens on a floor like that, you're not gonna like. No kidding? Well, we know we're not the pick. Wrong. The thing is, if you don't, danger floors will show up more and more often until you go for one. Seriously? Ugh, maybe we ought to bite the bullet. I don't want to be faced with three bad options later. Might as well. If it's too much, you can always spend some mem bucks to return to the elevator. Well, I don't know, wait, I'll leave it up to you. Germ battery drop does have a bonus. And it is germ battery drop. Damage close is a 15% increase. Hmm, and it's close, which is good for the roll for for the duelies. Danger. 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 Just remember, you got one life. Oh yeah. You got one shot. Springing swarmed. Huh. So, uh, I wonder what that could mean. Arpeggio barrage. These flying fucks are gonna come at us. Thick and fast. Hmm. Welcome to side order. Ooh, yeah, they're coming! They're coming thick! They make, like, Metroid-ass sounds, which is kind of cute. They do. They're cuteness. They're cuteness. Alright, let's hope we're a lucky bomb proc. Ooh! Let's leave! Good escape. Damn, they weren't kidding. That swarm can swarm. It's okay. They peeled off. That's one. Woo. That's what I like to see. Ooh, ouch. Okay, that's uh, that's not what I like to see. No, no, no. Well, music disc. Oh yeah, you can get one of those off. That's gonna be helpful here. You love to see it. The luck build paying off in spades. All right, this one's gonna be dicey. You're in the pit a little bit. Why? What's wrong? They're Actually, in the never mind. They're in the pit time. with me. <laughs> my pit. Her <laughs> city now. They come to my house for my mosh pit, and they tell me to watch out. <laughs> uh, spread reduction is good. I would like less spread reduction for just like my moving shots. Uh, this doesn't make like the whale stronger. It just reduces the points, and like when I'm getting the batteries, it's not that big a deal. So let's 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 go see our good buddies in an easy one. They are calling her the genius of gaming, making up for that really funny blunder with the the super earlier. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm never gonna live that one down, but at least it was pretty fucking funny. At, at least it was funny. If something bad happens, it has to be funny. Okay, 
So we got jumpers. And we got big boys. And of course, Boo Boo Wheel. And of course, Boo Boo Wheel. It's the Wheelers! Okay, and the roll does also shove him a little, which is nice. Mm -hmm. That that dodge roll damage is putting in the work. It's damage and a shove, which is nice. It's like fairly ample damage too, which I like. It's like 400 a tick, by the way, I did it. Oh, that's sticky ink too. I don't think I have sticky ink on this, do I? Wait, let's check. I thought I you got it, but maybe I'm remembering the last run. I forgot. Let's check. Uh, no, that's the collection. Palette. Uh, I don't have sticky ink, no. I had it last time. Okay, that's where I got confused. Radius of damage and turf inked by explosions. I'm not really doing a lot of explosions, but, but Pearl is... Mm. Sound wave damage is... Okay. For like Pearl's damage. I think mobile ink recovery is technically the best option. Yeah, I, I think with all the other stuff you got on now, it, it, it don't hurt to put a little bit into yeah. ink recovery. Let's let's get because that that's kind of what's getting me sometimes is suddenly I'm just out of ink. Mm -hmm. Um I'll I'll risk seeing the danger again, like next floor. Yeah. Who knows, maybe it'll be on, on a good chip for you. Hey maybe, hey maybe. Oh man, and this one's a zone. Come on. Come on. What's in the freaking It's armor, I take armor. Good to have armor. Oh, there's things coming. No, you don't! The zone is mine! Whoa! <laughs> Oh, right, the flutter. And fuck those guys. My ink? Let's leave. This is. Ooh, this is quite a long one that I have to do. Okay. This one's a little juicy with it. Ha! It jumped me while I was in my reef slider! <laughs> Woohoo! Yippee! Okay, get that guy before he gets close. Go. Okay, checkpoint. All right, she has her fucking out. cool anime hero shout outs when she's using her ability! Of she's course a nerd. she does! Look at her! Oh, right, sniper towers, by the way. Oh, yeah, sniper towers are here. That's an enemy, They're by the way. They're so funny, puppet looking. A little bit, huh? Okay, that gets the zone out of the control. Please, can I get you in range? There we go. Almost done. Ooh. Close, close, close. Oh, the fucking oh, flutter. Oh, come on. The, the fucking jumper making me jump out. <laughs> These rudely positioned springs. <laughs> was fun. That one was fun. That was a good one to be put into. I think we're past the Spire's halfway point. This place doesn't let up, does it? Are you holding up, eh? You should rest a little before we hit the next floor. No, I'm good! <laughs> okay! I'm so sorry you had to go through all this. If only Order hadn't found a way into my mind. Yo, don't feel bad! None of this is your fault, Marina. I mean, somewhere deep down, I, I did wish for a perfect world of peace where nothing had to change. It was a weakness in me that Order took advantage of. Lots of people are afraid of change. Even me sometimes. You too, Oct? Uh, personally, it's never been in my top ten fears. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, shit's different, so what? It's awesome. Top 10 fears, a really big spider, snakes with 1 million teeth, uh, the doctor's office, taxes, uh, numbers higher than 3. No, no, I get it. Stuff you don't really understand is weird and it scares you. Personally, I'm real scared of ghosts. 
Real glad I ain't got to deal with any ghosts lately. Ghosts, ghouls, goblins, my grandpa. If I was trapped in some kind of virtual world while I had to deal with ghosts all the time, I think I'd be in your position too. I get you, Marina. <laughs> but I know that whatever you wished for, it wasn't this. You don't got nothing to apologize for. Now, if you made me fight a ghoul, then you might have to apologize for that. I wouldn't be too happy about that. There's no ghouls in the simulation, are there? So, so dry those eyes! Aiden and me are gonna pump the brakes on order. Just sit back and enjoy the fireworks. I want a fireworks power. I want a fireworks gun. I guess that's what the lucky bombs are. <laughs> <laughs> See? But Pearl... Eight... No. I can't just sit back. I'm going to do whatever I can to help fix this. Good. With all of us pitching in, we'll make this right. Extra dodge roll! <laughs> Fucking finally! Fucking finally! Uh, more charge rate on the drone would have been pretty good. But we've got the lucky batteries. I'm taking the fucking dodge roll, and I'm getting the hell out of there. I'm taking the extra dodge roll and tackling you twice. And we get to see a booboo -boo wheel. We do also get to see booboo -boo wheel again. Everything's coming up, Holly. I need to watch more fucking super great, friend. I see people in chat making SGF jokes, and I'm like, I don't get that one specifically. I haven't watched him much in years. <laughs> Shoutouts to super great friend, though. Good stuff. Shout out. Hey, hey, hey! Wheel. Shit! This fucking, like, bathhouse tile ass room? <laughs> it's cute! You are going to get fucking washed, my friend! <laughs> Bumped him! Bounced him! I gotta be doing that now that I can do that. <laughs> Dude, the build is good! <laughs> Simply cartwheel into them until they explode one million times! The build is good! <laughs> the build is good! <laughs> I need another roll. I need another dodge roll. I need three or four. I need more. I need more. I need more. <laughs> Armor drop. I shouldn't- I should go for the vending machine. I shouldn't fucking risk this more. I should not fucking risk this more. But, man, that armor drop looked tasty. Man, that I armor know. drop looked tasty! I So that's the oh, vending honey. machine. Buying the life. Yeah, that 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 life's gonna pay for itself. <laughs> hey, hold up, that one's yellow. That's the luck one. What is Give me that shit? <laughs> <laughs> so how you feeling? The run is good. The run is good. It's needed badly. 90% bomb drop chance. That's so fucking scary. I don't really need knockback. 10% battery drop chance is good. I need to clear out this danger and Ink Saver Main is really good. Mhm. Mm so I think that's going to be worth it. <laughs> so Frantic double decker crisscross dot floor. Oh, yeah, and it's also got enemy ink all over the floor by default. <laughs> Bro, like, this sucks. Let's make it better. Whoa, it's looking gross in here. Try not to ink all over the floor. Whoops. Oh, it's two of them. Okay. Damn. Solid distance between them, too. Oh, no, it's just down there is all. Okay. I oh, I thought it was on the opposite side. I was like, damn, that's crazy. Yeah, I also thought that. Yeah. 
This is, uh... Oh, grind rail! Okay. Alright. Way. Let's just paint it from here. There we go. The run begins. Get the hell out of here. You go to hell before you die. All right, halfway, halfway. Let me get to somewhere where I can recharge my ink. That's two Ooh. disc pieces. That's three disc pieces. What if I just win? What if I just win? <laughs> <laughs> she played a little victory jingle for you. Hey, I think the luck build is good. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> I was just like, this will be fun to try out. I think this is fucked. <laughs> mm. More drone battery drop would be good. I'm doing pretty all right with my 7%. Sticky ink. Sticky ink. Sticky ink. So all these motherfuckers are stuck in my poison zone and also are stuck close to all the bombs that are dropping because they're dying. Let's put them in the sticky zone. I just should never say that again. Go to my sticky poison bombs. All right, this is another doubler. That's fun, that's fun. What do we got? Oh, the dirty doubler. These ones are really far apart, but at least there's ramps. Ooh, okay, we got, we got jump pads. Yeah, that's good, that's good, that's fun. I'm into it. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Doesn't Zappy take you all the way up. Okay, I see a motherfucker going to the zone. Get off of my zone. Mine, my armor. What? Hey, the what's this fuck guy? Is that? We haven't seen this guy yet. Dear god, those are eyes! <laughs> no, they're bombs. They are bombs. They might be eyes. They might be bombs. Okay, I need to get... There we go. I got a zone back so we're not losing time. I need to get this one back. Whoop! Okay, we lost two. Let's take you out. There, we got one back. There's another flutter coming, so let's take him out. It's not actually called a flutter, but it's what I'm calling them because they're flooding my damn zone. Mm -hmm. Mine. What do we got? Nothing. All right, halfway. Oh, missiles! That's yeah, fucked! They, they drop missile, guys. That's scary! Get rid of them. We got flutters going here. They took one zone already and I missed it. Well, you were busy with missiles. I was. I was having fun with missiles. Okay, so we got one back. That's good. We get the other back. Take the pearl. Awesome. So helping! This map rules. Mm -hmm. This is a really fun one. I see him already going for the other one. This son of a bitch. You're gonna yeah, get they trouble. They seem to do one on each side at around the same time. Ooh. 
No, I knocked him out of the zone! <laughs> Did myself dirty! I can't believe you can knock them onto your own zone by accident! That's awesome! That's awesome! <laughs> It is a ping pong tree sponge, and that's its real name. That's awesome. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's why it's called ping ponging. And also because you ping pong between the zones. Hey, odds are good that we're coming up on a boss. You'll need to be smart at the core and careful on top. Oh, Rina, you worry too much. It's gonna be just fine. The two of us got this. I can make one million bombs forever. Right. Of course. There's that unsolicited advice I'm so familiar with. Oh, I can't help it. Pearl's just too precious. She's fearless at the core and adorable on top. Oh, they're gay gay. Uh-huh. Huh. This side of you is less familiar. Listen, there's a crass joke to be made about adorable on top. This stream's oh, intended for trying. mature audiences. <laughs> I wasn't gonna say it, but like... <laughs> <laughs> look at them, we know, we know, we know, we, we know, know, we know. Also, look at this fucking, like, hair color combo. Mm-hmm. Alright, which am I getting? Which am I getting? I've never seen this one. New? Who are you? Ball? Hey, hang on, that's like a, just a straight-up construction lift that goes into the nothingness. <laughs> uh, there's like an urchin hiding a hole? There's a few urchin. They look almost like constellations up there. That's beautiful. What's that giant ball thingy? Watch yourself, mate! We fight a damn ball? A damn bad ball? Oh dear god, that's a damn bad ball. Look at his face! <laughs> bombs! It does just shit bombs on you. I see? Oh, this is funny. So you need to shoot it in a vulnerable hole. While it also shoots beams and bombs at you. All the while it's trying to blast you. Uh-oh! Uh-oh! Uh -oh. Okay! Oh! Uh -oh. You can knock me off off! Okay! It's sumo! It's a little bit sumo. Okay, so I need to, like, when it starts doing that, make a path to the side and book it. Uh-huh. Circle strafe. Get far away and s sideways. Whoop. I'm having so much trouble hitting your whole mana. The bumper. Ooh, and it's got a wave point. I see, okay. Well, get my luck up. You luck increase. It's going after the ball! It hates ball! It hates ball! Now it's got a tasty ring on the side. It's gone. It's good! Blast them! Alright, the bumper. Alright, that's one wave down. More bumpers! Oh god, it's got misses. Yep. Well, okay. It bumped me to safety. It saved me. You've saved me. This is so fucking scary. It's awesome. This fight rules? 
You get away from that ball! <laughs> Hated ball! Alright. It's just a little guy now. <laughs> Get exploded. Get bumped. Oh, this is fucking crazy. It's awesome. Hey, this fight rules. That was fun. That was fun. <laughs> yeah, right into the sunset. Oh. Hey, look oh. at my time. Three, three, three. <laughs> I, Yay! I think my talk sprite was blocking a little bit, but it was three minutes, 33 seconds on the dot. You can see it on the top here now. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Does that mean this is the run? Click going, eight. And we got to lock a key out of the deal. That boss, though, huh? This order creep ain't pulling its punches anymore. I must have made these to stop anyone from ruining its plan. I remember it said it wants to turn the Memverse into a colorless world of order. A world of mindless puppets, huh? Sounds exactly like where I was before I came here. Locked. You weren't in the Deep Sea Metro, were you? Hold up. The Deep Sea Metro? That's what we pulled eight out from! What the? What the the? That's the place. Someone or something there took my will away. I was forced to DJ for it. <laughs> it's rude to ask someone why they're green now. Maybe, maybe Ak just wants to be green. Marina's not gonna judge. They, they are just completely green, but it is a little bit funny. This is the first time it comes up. Now, to be fair, usually when you're sanitized, you also aren't, like, personable or able to talk to people or really act in any sort of way uh, that lets you, you know, have uh, any sort of control over yourself. So... <laughs> You know, fair. Maybe they're just green. Also, Pearl's a fucking robot right now. Well, yeah, We're because the Marina made her world. that way. Things could just happen. Yeah, Marina made her that way. I don't remember much about my time there. Except, I heard this voice. Point is, it's better left in the past. I can't believe you went through something so awful. You know, I developed the Memphis in the first place to restore the minds of sanitized Octarians like you. And since we're having this conversation, that means it must have worked. Huh. So that was you, was it? I'm racking up quite the debt. Well, this is even more reason to take back the Memphis from Order. Those other Octolings need help too! They mentioned that in the first dev diary, but we haven't read it on stream yet. <laughs> mm -hmm. We'll, 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 we'll do reading at the end of later. stream. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> vending machine. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're taking the vending machine. I'm buying a life if it's there. <laughs> oh yeah, it's needed. It's needed badly. This, this might be the run. I'm playing it safe. We've come this far. We're this strong. This, this is the farthest we've gone so far. <laughs> We'll buy the sprinkler. Funny sprinkler. I, I, I wish there was a chip here. I'll take the sprinkler. The sprinkler's good. Are we going to just beat the game before anything? We might. We're, we're certainly not going to lose on purpose. Another? <laughs> Second vending machine? I'm going to go for another whale. More whale. More whale. More whale. One stream game, I guess? No. <laughs> no. This is very much. You play this shit multiple times, over and over again, repeatedly, multiple runs, with different loadouts and different power-ups. 
so that you can unlock more things to do more runs over and over and over again. You, you don't... <laughs> it's not built to just be played in beat one. <laughs> The, yeah, the idea of someone just beating a rogue like once and then going, all right, I've had my fun. It was pretty cool. And then never picking it up again ever is really funny. Yeah. <laughs> what? Why would I play that again? I finished it. I defeated the enemy. Ball in. Ball in. Ooh. A lot of guys appear. They are carrying little guys on their backs, which is really funny. Yeah, they're carrying their sprinklers. Oh, my ink. Oh, my ink. It's fine. Check this out. <laughs> simply simply ride your bike away and explode. Oh, I am slow from the damages, but the chain is just keeping itself up forever. Wait, wait, a disc? Hang on. Hey, what if I just, uh... Real quick. <laughs> Don't! No! The... <laughs> Girl, the ball! Helping! Oh my god. <laughs> the fact that the chain just, like, becomes self-sustaining is awesome. Mm-hmm. More. Uh... Mm. More sticky ink sounds good, actually. And you get rid of the danger. And we do get rid of the danger. It's, it's, it's just tower control. How hard could it be? How hard could it be? It, it only a little tower control. It's just tower control. How bad? All the way down, then up again? Lights out, and <laughs> How bad could it be? <laughs> oh, God. You can't see Jackal. Okay. Okay. <laughs> really funny to see front facing fish coming at you in the dark. <laughs> I see. Yeah, I don't see, but. That is, in fact, the problem. We'll take armor, though. And things are somehow chaining down there, so... Well, yeah, because you got the sticky ink that poisons them forever. We do have... I'm mad. <laughs> okay, I'm mad. <laughs> At least Pearl will kill for you a little bit while you climb back up. <laughs> At least we hit the checkpoint. All of the pickups down there just despawning because I was nowhere close enough to pick them up. I want to be down here. Let's get a CD. God, it does a big boom. Oh, right, the stairs. The stairs that every single time I've missed because I think it's <laughs> wider than it is. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I keep thinking you can follow the rail exactly, and uh, no. 
Okay. Thank you for shooting the objective, my friend. She loves shooting the objective. It's her favorite activity. She is literally obsessed with it. It's awesome for her. She is! What's in here? Armor? Yes, please. <laughs> not too bad, not too bad. I'm, I'm not risking it. No. <laughs> However, know that in my heart of hearts, I was thinking about it, because it would have been so cool. It would have been so cool. It's fine, we just win. Woo-hoo-hoo-hoo! -hoo. I felt longer than three minutes! <laughs> Alright, not bad. Sticky ink more. Uh, ink recovery rate. More battery drop. Hmm. Um... I like better recovery in case we're in scenarios where we can't go for Lucky Chain. Mm -hmm. Bosses do seem to consistently spawn ads, so it's never like a big concern. I, I do appreciate that. Sometimes you get like a game like this where it's like, all right, your build is all about, um, you know, getting like kills on guys and sustaining like on kill effects and then keeps putting you in scenarios where you just don't get to use that ever at all. Uh, yes, this is basically Splatoon Hades, to some degree. Mm -hmm. uh, so Welcome I'm, to the funny roguelike mode! So, so I'm very glad that there is very consistently like, okay, you are you are in scenarios where we are spawning enemies for you to blow up. You will, you will always have that, don't worry. Or basically will always have that. Often enough to be worth, like, Investing it. Making yeah. a build around it. The luck build is real. I'm gonna take care of the sniper tower. That seems like a good idea. Disc. Okay, so you can't really tackle the, the, the torpedo heads. Sense, you you kind of can, but it, it'll get you in a bit of trouble if you do. You will get report. Mm -hmm. Okay, three. Let me get out of this. Never mind. I'm Ooh. Dead. Well, yeah, I was in way too deep there and realized that way too late when I had, like, no ink around me to get out. But, I mean, we got a checkpoint at three, so it's not too bad. Mm -hmm. Could be worse, could be worse. Let's go for the small one. <laughs> yeah, me too, Pearl. <laughs> what? Oh, it got bumped, man! Whoa, uh oh Oh! What got me? Was it the sniper? It was the sniper, okay. It yeah. was the sniper. That's fair. Good run. Oh, that was a good run, though. Good fucking run. Oh, you're gonna make bank! Plus I'm getting Tone Chain bonus. Plus I'm getting Tone Chain bonus. <laughs> so how many pearls is that? That's a few. <laughs> it's, a, it's a couple. <laughs> and two keys. All right, let's use those keys. <laughs> they did catch me slipping, though. That's on there. That's on us. Okay. <laughs> oh. My gay little hands together. Oh, Fry, honey, you oh, shouldn't okay. have. Oh, okay. Yeah, oh, the, fry, the, the ones you have. get after your first three are in random order. Um, my previous save file, I got Sniper as, like, my first one after your first three. And I was watching someone else, and they got fucking ink brush. I see. <laughs> yes, we found Fry's palette. Fry is so adorable. 
I love how every time we meet, she makes a beeline right for you. Yeah, it was always a toss-up whether she's coming in to hug me or punch me. Cute. <laughs> They're besties. I love them. Come to think of it, the glowing doors on these lockers seem to indicate which ones have pallets. I'm still getting lots of pallet signals in there, so keep switching up pallets and collecting keys. All right, what's next? Shiver. Okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Shiver is so graceful and elegant. Yeah, I guess. It's just... Sometimes when I'm talking to Fry, I can feel Shiver's eyes boring holes in me. <laughs> they are just throwing food at us. <laughs> With this shit. Yuri! Uh. Yuri! Really? Huh. Can't say I've ever noticed that. <laughs> Alright, what's up, Marina? Hey, I have even more hacks ready to deploy now. Take a look! What do we got? Broken armor speed. So when your armor breaks, you can go... You're not as slowed down as much. Pay Membox to keep going after losing all your lives. Huh. Reset the offered floor types and rewards. Yes, I'm taking that. A reroll is really good. I can get more double chip rate. Your palette's common color chips will be offered even more frequently. Yes. Yes, I want that, actually. Drone gauge splat charge. Unlocks chips that increase the drone gauge by defeating enemies. So we only have the two. Uh, drone ink strike. <laughs> oh my god? You can give her an ink strike? Okay. Let's see. It's 50 to give her another slot. And then, let's see. Uh, we can get an ink mine. I'm gonna go for the ink mine because the next run I'm gonna do already has a sprinkler. pearls. Can I buy anything with the 20 that I have now? Don't think so. Oh, yeah. Hang on. Uh, guaranteed vending machines, which you can pay for. Um, vending machine reset. Yes, I will take a reroll on the vending machine. That sounds great, actually. Uh, this just makes that shit cheaper. Okay. We are starting to get some upgrades. Yeah. We're going for the Brella build. Shotgun time! Most common tone. Pearl. Second most common tone. Power. Hmm, hmm, hmm. We also got Agent 4, which is range and mobility, Shiver, which is mobility, then range, and Fry, which is lucky, and drone, which is kind of what we were going for on this. So... So... Maybe next time I go for Pearl's palette, I lean less into the drone power-ups and more into, like, support and luck. And then this is the one I go for when I want lucky, but also the drone. But I did say I was going to do Marina's first. <laughs> She's kind of awesome. In. Elbator. What time is it? It's only 11 o'clock. Okay. <laughs> Move on! Get pumped! Anything could happen! I rein it in a little. Though I agree with the sentiment. I will rein in nothing! Okay, let's go for... Um... None of these. Let's pay for the reset. We have the money for it. The bomb. Bombs? The bomb. You want it? 
I do want it. That's why I'm taking it. Sprinkler Inkstorm for Brella goes kind of crazy. In this mode, it sure fucking does. It's really good. It's really good. You dickheads have bitten my damn ball. For the last time. What is this one doing? I think we're the next one. There. Look at how oh. far it knocks that shit back! This is the power of the shotgun! Special little shotgun just for you! This is the power of Splatoon shotgun! Pyramid dot floor! How many balls jokes are there in the world? None. Okay, well... <laughs> you want drone power up? We're giving you drone power up. Goal is miracle. I, I literally only saved the one picture to throw up on my stream. I should have saved the other ones. Like, made a slideshow or something. I'll do that for next time. My important ball slideshow. No, no, no. None of that. What is going through those tubes? Oh, you know. Fish. Could be fish. Might be fish. Possibly fish. Oh, it just instantly gets your shield away. Okay. So don't use it to try and clear the ports. Next. Oh, yes, yes. See, it just creates a nightmare zone, and it shreds, like, portals and anything in it. You get, like, sticky ink, and you get poison ink, and you get people in your ink take more damage, and you throw out a sprinkler, uh, and you are off to the races. You just have a zone of nightmares. You make the nightmare zone. Mm -hmm. uh, let's also give you an ink mine! Let's also give you an ink mine! <laughs> oh, this is the run where Pearl gets to kill. Now that you can slot three things. What if I slot you three things? What if you put an ink mine on the zone we're defending so that we defend the zone? Down a little aggressively, actually. No, you don't. No, you don't. You are not welcome in my world. Leave. <laughs> More. More. All right, what's next? Oh, oh, you shouldn't have. Oh, gift for Holly. Prevents the shield from launching. I don't want that on this run, but that's neat. I'm taking main piercing. It begins. <laughs> it begins. <laughs> oh, don't worry, Sevmal. Making the railgun was always the plan. Now and forever, this is the plan.
it just kind of shreds through them. Yeah, it kind of does! Thank you, puppy, for helping me. You are honestly so helpful, guy. Go ball! Oh, there's a tiny wall there. Yes! Yes! <laughs> oh, all those red numbers! Flatten them. <laughs> the killdozer. See, I'm a little sad that the balls can't fall off anymore, but also because they can't, it does help the pace of these levels not be uh, a crawl. <laughs> so. <gasps> <laughs> Poison ink, you say. <laughs> they, they really saw that last run and said, Eh, you know what? You know what? That was a good one. We'll, 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 we'll give you the next one. Poison ink, you say. Well, if you insist, who am I to say no? Who am I to say no to more poison ink? No, no, no. You go in there. In the hole. Go in the hole. Yeah. Teleport to the hole. It's hole time for you. Why did you fish explode? Teleport to the hole. Go to, <laughs> Go to the hole. It's hole time for you. Oh no 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 you don't you coming into my camera motherfucker you're staying in the bad zone. <laughs> this is not your ball. I like this pace, eight. Speaking of pace, I wanted to remind you you can make the cage go faster by tilting the left stick. There's nothing wrong with letting it go on its own. But if you're in a hurry, why not give it a nudge? What the fuck is a left stick? More damage, you say. <laughs> or... Or... Increases the size of your main weapon's shots. This is just 5% damage. Versus almost double the size. Super and... shotgun. And you get to see Boo Boo Wheel. And I get to see Boo Boo Wheel and I get more coins as a reward. There's no downside. Big blast. Pursuit all out. A fun looking stage. Okay, well, that'll be ready for you whenever you get back there. Uh huh. Have a blast on him. This dude is chucking out, uh, what's it called? The bad ink. This dude's invoking dumb shit. And so he must go to hell. Or he dies. Uh, get in my poison? That's easy. It's that easy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Nox, I do feel that. They do kind of let you build up to just a straight up Grizzco weapon sometimes. Um. How about more splat bomb and also I get a bonus? Yes. I'll build up more money. I don't want to spend it right now when I don't have much yet. I do gotta go on break soon, but gaming. Range saturation, you say? Don't mind if I do. 
don't mind if I do. I think this is, like, huge piercing, because, like, piercing was one of the range ones, wasn't it? I think so. Where are the portals? I'm just shooting the guys and not doing the objective. Fly, my friend. Be free. Yeah, this saturation business is pretty fun. <laughs> hey man, make way, make way, make room, come through. Big motherfucker is back in town. You better straighten up. Or, or gay up, I guess. My drink. Come on. More? More? Uh, or faster charge. I think I want faster charge so that Pearl can do more, but also I think I want to take a break for a couple minutes. <laughs> Damn, this night is just flying. It kind of is, huh? <laughs> All right. I'm getting up. I'm doing my stretch. I'm getting more to drink. Uh, get, a, get yourself a drink. Get a snack if you haven't eaten in a while. Have a stretch for yourself. I'm just running ads for three minutes so you're not missing anything. See you real soon.
Okay, I'm back in the hot seat. Woohoo! Yay! Yay! How you feeling, hun? I'm having a good time with my wife who's so good at video games. Yippee! I'm okay, Adam. <laughs> How's your energy levels? A little sleepy, but otherwise good. Okay. Maybe after this next block of stream we call it then for the night it is getting on almost midnight for me so yeah at, when, when we get to the next like hour it'll be well past midnight for you <laughs> how would you feel about maybe streaming this tomorrow i'd be down okay i might also be down <laughs> main Video piercing games. more main piercing would be good I think I want more charge, because I'm not going to have the obscene luck anymore. We're not building mm -hmm. for that. And also, this gives me more money. More money means more happy or whatever. Wait. <laughs> Up and down high tower. All oh, right, it's th it's the funny wheels. Oh, wheel time. This has been a little bit of a funny wheels run. A little bit. A lot of funny wheels tonight. Hey, they're all in a pile! They're getting stuck in my zone. They're close to my zone. They're just about to my zone. First and last mistake. <laughs> he got confused, he came back! <laughs> Fastest I've ever cleared that, let's go. <laughs> Alright, more charge. Uh, let's go for more bomb. I think I can handle a rigorous. I think I can handle a rigorous. Save up more to spend more later. A drink of water. Right before a boss, so I'm feeling confident. Two zones. I wonder which one we'll get, because I think we've seen all three now. Not on this run. Or not on this save file. We not on this save file, no. But you and I, as humans, have seen all three. Yes. So you gotta ride the rails to properly get to all the different spots. I see, I see. Counter snipe. Alright, let's send this out. There's two of these motherfuckers here and I missed my way up. This is a little tricky for Umbrella, which doesn't have huge range. Mm -hmm. Isn't really made for that. So let's get this back. Let's get this back. This one is not taking there. Okay, so there's like one path each way. It's not like you can choose which way to go. You do have to go to the one. Oh no! They they both go like this. Okay. Huh. Figuring it out, figuring it out. I'm learning the level. There we go. I fell. Damn. I'll get you here where you stand. You will regret your words and deeds. Go, let's go up. Hey, that sniper just appeared right next to me, next to me. Pearl just gently bonking that thing with bombs! Right, I can fucking glide over. I need to be using the glide for this. Mm -hmm. This, this is a glide moment. Get out of here. The timer's not ticking down at the moment, at least. Let's get this one back. That's 
checkpoint. Good. There we go. Do not like you spawning up there. Oh, the shorter they are, the faster they can shoot. Ah. That's a little scary. Okay. Good to know. Noted. Let's shoot that out. No, you're gonna come here and try and flood my zone, so I'm gonna get you out of here. So we don't lose progress, we're losing progress. There we go. Get that up there again. There we go. You are about to fucking so win, so bitch. Close. Yippee! That's a fun little dance. It's a it's a little bit <laughs> tough with the umbrella. <laughs> mm -hmm. But hey, I did it. Now it's boss time. Go there. What are we getting? Who have you got for us this time? Who's it gonna be? It's the damn ball again, okay. A damn bad ball. The ball is cool. I was kind of hoping for uh, the one we haven't seen yet in this save file. Mm -hmm. Well, hey, if this run goes well enough, we will be seeing that one eventually, no matter what. Uh, I mean, not necessarily. Are there more than three bosses? Well, there's the three bosses and there's the final boss. Ah. So you only ever get to see two of them in a run. Ah. I see, I understand. <laughs> that was scary. Huge range weapon, but it is more range than the than than the dualies. <laughs> so it's a little easier I love to it blast just it. Rolling around, screaming. Uh huh. Speaking of screaming. Ooh. Yeah, now it's really screaming. Zooming, zooming. Yeah. Uh -oh. oh, it. Okay, I see. Go. Okay, no problems here. Let me run up on you and get you while you're cracked open. Get that thing right in its crack. That. Th th therein is the plan. Hey, we did it. Deus Ex Human Revolution has triangles that appear when that happens. It's so funny. Any second now, Adam Jensen's gonna come out and be like, I never asked to be put in the computer world. Just <laughs> finished up playing for the night to celebrate spring break. Hey, happy spring break! Thank you, weird walleye, for that 10 months up. I'd appreciate it. 
I ask for everything. I... This always happens to voice actors that end up doing commercials, but ev- now every time I hear Adam Jensen, I just think about, like, the local car commercials he did. They're not even, like, <laughs> super local. They're just, like, I think Canadian commercials, because he's a Canadian guy. Makes sense. Hey, the gelatins will start to swarm you after this, so don't let yourself get cornered. Good advice. Stay alert. One enemy or a hundred. We gotta do what we gotta do, am I right? Eight knows. You'll get me. Oh, I gotcha. You I get me. I don't want distant damage, so let's go to the vending machine and see what we got. Funny vending machine time reel. <laughs> the ball icon is so funny. <laughs> ball. Okay. Refills ink by moving... Splash wall, triple splash down. I want to reset my stock. Give me something else, please. It's a damage up. It's two damage ups. <laughs> All right, we have cashed out eight dollars to my name. <laughs> That's why they call her eight. That's why they're always calling her eight. The new art for this is so, so cute. It is. My wife knocked it out of the fucking park. Yo, that's me. Main damage close, you say. <laughs> Main damage close, you say. Well. What if more damage? Well, if you want my shotgun to do better at close range, who am I to deny you? Who am I to say no to this? This fart ass music? <laughs> Funny music! Alright, here they come, clicking clack down the tracks. It's lots and lots of trains. It's lots and lots of guys. Let's take care of this sniper. Before it causes me more grief, more guff. Let's get close to the sniper at all. Got him. All right. Back to it. Set up my nightmare zone. Enter the nightmare. You will fight and die in my nightmare zone. Again. No, you don't. Explode forever. Oh, the music is nice. What if I just... <laughs> Let's open the box, it's armor. Delicious armor, just for you. Delicious, delicious armor. Let's put the flutter sprinkler down next to the sniper tower. As a joke, as oh, a prank. Oh, there's two of them. Okay, I see. Oh, 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 oh. No, no, no. I'll pass. Hee <laughs> hee. Kindly. Let's get her going. I do love this build. I do love this build. <laughs> I can't believe they took the fucking sprinkler and they made it an honest to god threat. It's good. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. They want you to win. They want me to win. Okay. Well. Here's how the sprinkler still can win. This is the run. It's too early to say we're on the 13th floor. But this is the run. And more fart music! It's the fart song again! <laughs> I'll take the early special for you.
I'm not the one who's cornered, all of you are! <laughs> and look how far it just went on its own! <laughs> And then the sprinkler is out again. <laughs> With the rain. With the rain. Enter my nightmare zone. What if Enter you went... my shower hell. What if you went to my damn bad world and there was no escape? Like literally, what would you do? You're 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 getting sprinkled. Oh yeah, you're getting you're getting pearl mined. Nice going through it. Oh, he's going through it, all right. <laughs> Chase down the sniper. None of that. Wait, how did you get here? When did when did you get here? Oh, you know. I don't. We. Oh no, my ink, whatever will I do? <laughs> Wait, <I guess. laughs> he headbutted the other man off? They do a little bit do that sometimes, it's fun. Okay. Now I could take the danger and get more bomb powered up. However, I really want main piercing. I really want more main piercing. <laughs> I really, really like main piercing on the shotgun. I really like it. <laughs> I really like it. Turbine tower again? Don't mind if I do. Don't mind me, coming through. Excuse me. On my way to work. Put this here. Alright, off we go. Another day at the races. We're having so much fun. Guys just exploded off screen, which is pretty funny. This ain't about them. <laughs> Not anymore. Hey, why do I have a 10 chain? What happened? Oh, uh, well, you see, 30 guys just exploded off screen. This ain't about them. <laughs> <laughs> the concept, the conceit of a rail shotgun is strange and gross. All right, let me put it this way flat cannon. Uh, more ink mine, and we get rid of a danger. I think that's the play. I think that's the play. Could be the play, could I'm not, be the I'm run. Not, I'm not going in on luck. I'm fine. <sighs> Alright, what do we got? No item <laughs> Oh no, we're not getting items to appear in this run. Oh no, this run. whatever what, are we going to do? How, how will I manage? What will I What will I do to get all these balls into the gold if I can't pick up items? How will I possibly deal? I, I just don't know how we're going to do this one, honey. I might as well forfeit now and give up. The main piercing! Oh, my ink. Right, I need that. Let's go on a bit of a walk. Here. Just a quick one. It's fine. What's wrong? Just don't panic. So, where is the goal that I have to get it to? Oh, oh there it is. I see. Okay. Over there. Over there. Look at these shirks. Just 
swimming around, having a good time. You guys move, I'm trying to get up there. Oh, you were like glowing, glowing. You had the rage in you. Where did balls go? were being had. Where is my ball? Where's the damn ball? Where is my ball? Ball? Oh, there you are. Okay, well, that's where I wanted it, so. Oh no, it's so sad, the run is over, we couldn't handle no item drops. What a shame. That level that said it? open season, it kind of felt like it the way I was going through them. <laughs> Fucked. Don't you get bored staying in the elevator? Nah. On its own, this elevator heads back to its default position. Without someone to stay inside and keep watch, you'd all be trapped on the current floor. Game over. Well, for real? No one mentioned that part! I don't know if that's the full story. As long as I've known Arch, they've liked cramped spaces and leaning against walls. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that true? I don't know what you're... Huh. Now that you mention it, there is something soothing about this elevator. <laughs> They're one of those octopuses squeezing into a little pot. Uh-huh. Um, I don't have a lot to take advantage of this, so I'm not super inclined to get it on this build. Mm hmm Uh, more mine. Some ink save remain would not be remiss. This is bonus, though. Hmm. That is hmm. bonus. And five whole more men bucks. Five whole dollars more. And also <laughs> more mines. The, the mines are good whenever Pearl's able to dump them out. Mm-hmm. They're putting in some work. Just every now and then, you just get to go, nope, you're too close to me, you're gone. No gliding. Oh no, how will I manage? How, how, how will I possibly do this? My show. I don't know what happened to the the guy that was launching the missiles at me. He's just gone. Okay, there's another one spawned. But what Exploded. got the first one? Oh, the rain, maybe. Might have been the rain. Might have been the rain. You you, okay, you did in fact send them into the rain that makes them poisoned. I, I, I do have the poison rain, that's true. We, we, uh, we are engaging with the poison challenge, now that you mention it. So that was Welcome to Splatoon Flutter. 3 side order, acid rain is back, baby! Yay! Question mark! Oh, I wanted to get that guy so bad. Oh well. Calling that level projectile spam is funny when I just kind of instantly cleared out the projectile spammers with my rain. <laughs> Homing shots with danger. Brella cooldown. I would love faster Brella charges because I love shooting this thing out. So. Yeah, and a second and a half is not negligible. <laughs> that is a significant amount of time in a game as fast as this. Mm hmm. I feel like if you get enough of those and get the cooldown low enough, you're just you just have a fucking rocket launcher. You have a slow methodical rocket launcher, but a rocket launcher all the same. Alright, welcome to my fortress. Not one of you is gonna survive this. Sure, I'll take armor, I like armor. Armor good, armor good. Go for an armor. Hey, you wanna you wanna come lower so I can blast you? Thank you. Checkpoint. Any nasty spillers. Ha! 
They're getting touched here! My, my fucking camera? You get out of my house. This is my house. What are you doing in my house? Where did you- <laughs> You just went somewhere! <laughs> Goodbye! <laughs> You're playing at the same time and can't believe the Splatling set is the one you're doing the best with? Let's go! I can't fucking wait to unlock the Splatling. That's gonna be oh, fun. Oh, when Holly gets a Splatling, it's fucking over. Oh, it's something, alright. Um... Let's... Let's vending machine. I've got some money banked up. Let's spend. Mm-hmm. Let's spend. And even even if there isn't anything worth buying, it it's a free floor. Can't say no to a freebie, you know? Well, I mean, you can say no to a freebie. I have multiple times in this run. <laughs> Ink more turf with your main weapon while moving, such as a roller or a brush. Let's go for the reset. I'm not interested in any of these. The fizzy bomb is really good. I am fine with what I have. Range, though... Range, though. More range, though. Range, though. Considering we have a lot of piercing. Um, don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. Drum gauge charge. Ink saver sub. Ink recovery rate. I want more drone gauge, Phil. More drone gauge for me. More drones, please! Yes, more pearl power, please! Ball. Oh, no, portals. Okay. Just three. Oh, is that a gar? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, that is! Yo! Love these background fish! <laughs> it is currently real gar hours. See, we got no luck bonuses and we're almost at like a whole ass music disc. Mm hmm. Mm. We're spicy in this corner. Ah, I needed to shoot instead of just trying to swim my way out. I keep thinking that I can just swim my way out when I'm slowed down like that. It's not how it works. This is not multiplayer. You get slowed down. You get slowed. Bye. <laughs> Shove that guy to hell! Later, hater. To make that. Left. Go. Feeling good, feeling good. Damn, you guys are up here, up here, huh? Okay, noted. I literally can't even tell what bumped me, but it sure bumped me. We win. Whew. Yeah, it is funny the way the, uh... The, the succulent bite parrotfish motherfuckers just knock their butts away. Just, nope, you're out of here. Sorry. Uh, boss time. Well, let's hope I don't die to this boss. Let's hope. Oh, it would be a darn shame if you did. It's been a good run so far. I'd like to keep going. A good run. I've got the weapon I like. <gasps> yes, yes, it's the one I was yeah! hoping for. Yeah! This one rules! The dreaded cone. What's this funnel looking thing? This place looks like a fucking prison, I just noticed. This place is so scary! Oh, 
this thing rules. It's like the fucking... What is it? The Panopticon? Where it's like the prison that can see everything or whatever? Yeah, yeah! It's like that! Oh, that drop! Whoa, that's Ooh. mean to me! Putting that behind my shield. It's fine, you don't see me. You didn't see me, actually, I wasn't there. It's fine. <laughs> what Octoling! What agent? I'm not there. I weren't there today at all. I didn't come in today! Now it's crying at me? Ooh, 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 okay, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Everything's okay, everything's gonna be okay, just don't panic. See? Literally no problems here. Nothing's ever gone wrong here. <laughs> I'm not here? Oh, that- I think that was a bit of like the, the Octoboss's sting in there. That's awesome. I love this music. Uh-huh. Ooh, oh, I do hate the, the stinger bit, though. The themes are not- I need to get closer. That's the play. Mm -hmm. There yeah, we go. Can't get you if you're under. Oh, it was stunned, but I couldn't find where to damage it. Okay, we did. It's really that easy. It's honestly that easy. Deus Ex Human Revolution. Get me out of here. I, I like looking over at one of our friend chats and seeing in all caps, What do you mean you can hide in the ink? Yeah, because you're not moving. So it doesn't see, like, a trail of you moving, so it doesn't think, oh, there's movement. <laughs> I'm going to go to the vending machine. <laughs> life? 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 What if a life? What if a tasty, juicy life? I'm gonna go buy a life at the vending machine. <laughs> I'm gonna go chug to get charged. Yes, please. Oh, a red one, you say? I wonder what that could... Well, that's not bad. It's not awful. <laughs> and I got a life, so I cannot complain. What a fucking rip! I want chips! We have chips in the lobby. Well, the cool dad, you say. I do need to get rid of the danger, and faster splat bomb is good. I'm going to get rid of the danger. Because that's been hounding me for a while. It's danger on an easy one. Fe Field of explosions? They're taking Pearl! Okay, well. Yo! Eight! It's fine. Check this well, out. Well, good luck, buddy! Check this out. Oh, this is a fun gimmick. The huge level. Merry huge miss. Oh, ho, 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 ho. See, this this would be scary if it was our last our last build and we inspect so hard on the pearl. Yep. We we've, we've still spec hard into pearls, the thing. But we True. we also had like luck boost for other stuff, so we, it, I think it would've been fine. <laughs> oh, the big men are bringing in the nasty stinkers. Yeah, they love to do this. I noticed they were doing that a couple times and it was cute. Hey, hey, no, no, no. We don't have to fight. They love to carry their their friends. Helping. They're literally so helpful. So, so helpful, helpful, doggy. 
Anyways, I got the zone back. So it's that easy. Oh, just a little more, just a little more. It's that easy. What's wrong? Yeah! I wonder if Pearl can still use the disc when she's not allowed in a level like that. <laughs> It'd be a little funny if you just got the disc and then just nothing. Uh-huh. Main damage distant? Eh. Uh, although, uh, you know... Let's play a floor reset and get a different roll. More bomb, you say? Yeah, I'll get a full upgrade on the bomb, why not? <laughs> sure. What if you were just shitting out explosions all the time? This is such a funny palette. Extensively circuitous <laughs> turbine. Hmm. Alright, where are we going? You are slow the whole way through. Sunfish huh? in the background. Well, take the poison charge, so that's fine. You guys go back there, and you have trouble for a while. Oh, I see. If you pop all the bubbles, they die. That's what was killing them so fast. Back ah. when I was setting up, like, the rain on them. It was just popping all their bubbles. That would do it. That would do it. That makes sense. I understand now. A lot of things in the world really make sense if you take the time to think about them. That makes a guy wonder. Okay, the layout of this level is pretty fun. Mm -hmm. Like the funny tunnel. Uh-huh. It's like going all the way back around after going through it. No, 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 Ooh. I have a shield. It's okay. It's a little juicy down here. <laughs> I am the juicer. <laughs> you are a bit the juicer today. Oh my god, he flung both of the other tops off! Bye! Put this up here while I have space to use it. And in we go. Any second now. Any second now. Any second now. <laughs> Yippee! Alright. Damage dealt to enemies when they're slowed by your ink or toxic mist? <laughs> yes, I think <laughs> I want that one, actually. Um, I don't care about main damage distant. More drone charge gauge would be good. I'm gonna go for the hindrance. I'm gonna go for the hindrance. Twenty-four, huh? Oh. Oh. Well, I mean, that's just the bonus, though. So you don't have to do it. Right, but I love bonus. You do a bonus. Fuck it. I don't need a bonus. That that's a little bit more bonus than it's worth. <laughs> There they are. Yes, you motherfuckers, get on my damn bad ramp. That's one. The Mola Mola flying around in the background is quite cute. It's so cuteness! His cuteness it's is restored. It's so cutie with it! His cuteness is restored, I'm happy to say. Hey, 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 let's talk about it. We are still getting quite a bit of bonus. What are you doing? Where'd you go? Oh. 
to hell. That's where you went. Yippee! Not too bad, and I still get some bonus, which is pretty cool. That's still almost as much as I got as the normal clear reward. So. Yeah, you did, in fact, still almost double your winnings. Mm, more close damage. More close damage. Yes, go there. Go there. Go there. <laughs> yeah, like, in such a wide map as that, with wide hallways, where you want to try and, like, make space as much as possible, like, just dump out a bunch of damage in front of you as much as possible, or make a bad zone for them to run into. The sprinkler is not great on that specific map. I fucking- I stand by the sprinkler being so fucking strong in, uh, this game mode, though. It's so fucking strong. Mm -hmm. you, you it has sprinkler. had a lot of utility. I will take my ink and I will go. Bye. Yes. Oh. Hey, 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 hey. Let's talk about it. Let's hear no, some no, shots no, no, about no. it. Hey, you get off my damn bridge, okay? Think back. Simply off the bridge and into the poison zone. Okay? You took the poison challenge. Think about the poison challenge. Really consider the poison challenge. I got a bail. <laughs> Goodbye. What if my shield? What if my shield? Oh, wow, it was, like, almost at the goal. Okay. <laughs> it was just right there. <laughs> yeah, all right. Sure. <laughs> all right. Oh, damn, I'm having a frame drop. Hang on. Uh, let's wait for that to... Uh... Yeah, all right. Let's wait for that to stop happening. Hmm. Whole stream without it. Oh, okay. I thought that was on my end. No, very seems much on my now. end. Uh, yeah, it seems to have... My, uh, my internet was getting chunky earlier, so I just assumed it was me. <laughs> hang on, I'm gonna say it in chat I before I get good. three million messages about it. Refresh. <laughs> One person has posted, hmm, uh-oh. <laughs> no, just fucking refresh. Enough. <laughs> All right. We're safe. It's safe to be here again. It's fine. It's normal. This one's going pretty good. Hi. Feels like we gotta be getting close now. You're right. We're almost at the top floor. Oh, yeah. Should be long before we get this wrapped up. Then it's back to our world tour. Off the hook, was it? I'm eager to get out of here so I can catch your act. Our science is tight! Peep the disclaimer first, because we've been known to blow minds. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> She's actually awesome. <laughs> oh, right, this is my line. <laughs> we still have a few shows left in our tour. You and Aid are more than welcome to come see one. I'll think about it. Though it'd mean flying. Never been on a plane before. Um... I don't know if I want to risk it. I don't know if I want to take a rigorous just for more mine. Let's get more charge on everything for a normal. Mm-hmm. Seem seems like a safer bet at this stage in the game. Forgot they have planes? The <laughs> One of the they new stages they added planes. is a whole ass airplane. Uh, airport. But there is a Pearl and Marina airplane in it. Arpeggio Barrage. I didn't even notice this was a danger one. Okay. Well, missiles are coming. Well, you ran at me for some reason. He got confused. He was scared. This motherfucker's getting scared. Get his ass. Let's 
get rid of the ball busters. I'm calling them for some reason. Oh, okay. I thought I could turn that around much faster. I cannot. What? Ooh! That's saying a big range, Ooh. okay. Yeah, what even got you? The bomb. Oh. The bomb that was scary. on the ledge. Which I thought I was out of range of, but was not. <laughs> ink on that bit, so it's a little harder to get the poison challenge on him. <laughs> Let's stop here for a bit. It's amazing. Let's take some spares. Fewer bombs, motherfuckers. I keep forgetting I have a damn glide. I gotta use my damn glide. Mm -hmm. New mechanic, I need to get used to it. No, you don't. No, you don't. Thank you, actually. Out of here. Where is good friend Funny Wheel? Oh, Boo Boo Wheel! Boo Boo Wheels, where have you gone? There we go, the corner. Oh, there! They're all there! <laughs> Fucking all of them are there. They love to all get together in a little pile. No, no, no. Whoa, scary. This is literally where I died last time to a bomb. I'm not letting it happen again. Unless I let it happen again. One. That's two. Two. Mosh Pit is looking a little scary down there. A little bit. Okay. Oh, okay. Sure. Yeah, all right. <laughs> I won't say no. I won't say no. I won't say no to that, but uh, I'll scratch my head a little bit. <laughs> uh, bonus umbrella cooldown. Hmm. Yes, I want more umbrella cooldown. That's only half a second, but that's still really good. A decent reward, too. That's still really good for me. I'm really hoping for another vending machine so I can get a life. Because this might be the run, if so. But uh, we'll we'll see. Don't use special weapons. Um, I might anyways. Oh, trampoline zone. <laughs> Okay, well, the sprinkler has prevented that from healing itself, so that's good. Thank sprinkler you, OP. Your, your service once again. <laughs> I like this being in Trambopoline Zone. This is the funny jump world, it's pretty good. Okay, let's peel off. That's a little mean giving me the special can on the don't use the special. Okay, one left. I suppose it's well, not ah, always ah, a ah, it's over. Zone. Ooh. I have no idea what oh. you said at all. There was too much happening, hon. I needed to focus. I'm sorry. Understandable. <laughs> oh, that went so quick. Ooh, I probably should have just popped my special. But hey. It's a couple points. It's one or two points. It's a couple points. Couple pearls. <laughs> it's one or two pearls. <laughs> it's a few pearls. Hey, we got two keys too. Let's see. Mm-hmm. 
Another diary. Mm -hmm. So far, we got a new locker key every time we beat a boss with a new pallet. On the next pile of order, and why not try out a pallet we don't have any keys for yet? Fucking Sheldon. This motherfucker. I don't want this shit. <laughs> oh, this pallet's from Sheldon! Where'd Sheldon move to again? Slatsville? He's found a whole new audience for his lectures on weapons, and I love that for him. Oh, those poor, poor saps in Splatsville. What you got for us, Marina? More hacks. Let's see, what do we got that's new? Just straight up damage up, okay. Not bad, not bad. Not bad, not bad. I can get more pearl stuff. It's it's just damage up, okay. Let's go for guaranteed vending machine. Let's go for guaranteed vending machine. Ninety for another life. I might go for it. I I feel like at at the levels you've been getting at these runs having another, another life, life would like make it more much more consistent to get farther yeah mm -hmm. um let's see i only have three slots for her but i mean i could unlock these other options for her just have them oh also increase the drone gauge by inking the ground increase the drone gauge by defeating enemies oh yeah oh yeah I'm taking that one. Kill more for more pearl. Hmm. How much do I get from my new chips? 24. Are any of these 40 bucks? Are any of these 40 bucks? I saw a that were 30. I could go for broken armor jump. So that I just kind of get leaped up a little high when I get when I get bopped, which mm -hmm. might be good. I, I feel like combining that with the glide is a real good get out of danger card. Or maybe broken armor speed, because there's been so many situations where I get slowed and I get fucked up because I am not used to being so slow. Mm hmm. So that might be worth a grab, or I could get drone gauge turf jar. <laughs> Drone gauge turf jar. <laughs> <laughs> Drug gauge turf <laughs> Um and there's oh yeah, this one just like makes the easy the first couple of floors easier. Uh, and then it shows you what the boss is gonna be. Okay, that's uh that's some investments. It's midnight. I it's wanna play Well I wanna, past midnight. I wanna play more is the problem. <laughs> Uh, hmm, hmm, hmm. Now remember, we are we have dedicated to trying and playing again tomorrow. I know, I know. Um, and I can I can definitely feel like the getting tired making me play worse, which is just gonna make me like more disappointed in playing worse because I'm tired. Uh, mm. but oh man, my fun new toy. <laughs> I know, you love your fun new toy. <sighs> My awesome toy. And Marina's there. And uh, Marina's there. Pearl's there, but you can't see her in camera mode. Yes, you can. Pearl's there. I love that she has a little, like, battery pack. Uh-huh. She really does look like the guy from Flubber. I still don't know her. <laughs> Have I spinned out here yet? <laughs> Let's go. She's having fun. <laughs> Yo, Movina, check this out. She loves it. She literally loves it. We've got all these logs to read. I'm too tired to read them right now. That's what tomorrow is for. Perhaps we start with reading. Mm. 
Hey, that's the Dungeon Meshi character. Oh yeah, I know her. Pathetic woman. This one's so cute, it's got a jaw. <laughs> My little friend, he loves to blow up on me. Damn, I've defeated enough of these to get a whole ass extra log. Alright. And you're close on a lot of them! Defeat 1,800 more to unlock. That'll honestly be pretty quick. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, those guys are everywhere. Uh, battering Lento. Does that make them good or bad allies? <laughs> Let's see. Oh, we're missing a couple of chips. Uh, this one is for a sword. Some of them are, like, specific weapon exclusive, which is fun. Mm -hmm. Um... Hey, hey, speaking of which. What pallets we got for next time? Uh, normal ass gun with a normal ass bomb. Uh, stringer. Which does have a uh, sonic beam. So that'd be a good one for taking sound up. And then mm -hmm. also getting sound on Pearl. The blade. <laughs> Which, uh, is luck and drone, and also is the fucking sword. So I'm a little inclined to try it next time. Mm -hmm. Uh, you know, you know, the brush is pretty cute, actually. That's concrete. It's concrete, baby. And you got movement and luck on it, which is an interesting combo. Movement makes sense for the brush, and also the brush has some stuff that's like, um... When you're, like, doing, like, a, a roller roll or a brush move forward, you, like, do more damage and knock people back more. And then there's, like, stuff for doing uh, squid surges and squid rolls that make those do damage, like the, like the dodge roll on the dualies. And it's, like, a fairly hefty chunk of damage, too, from what I remember. I'm a little sad I wasn't able to beat it tonight, but I got close. You got real close. I, I got close on, like, two different weapons, so that feels pretty good, I suppose. Mm-hmm. And now we saw I've... every boss except the final one, which is fun. We did. Now that I've got, you know, one more life, I think I can probably do it pretty consistently. Or mm -hmm. more consistently. Next run might be the run. More upgrades to touch later. It's a weird dog. Oh, tapping your little feet. Oh, ho, ho. Oh, ho, ho. Oh, ho, ho. That's a good guy. It's a good little guy right there. All right, well, that'll do it. So, back to the plaza. I got badge. Yay! Wait, this is... Oh no, it's not. It's 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 the one plaza. I got scared for a second and thought it was the two <laughs> plaza. Where am I? How did I get here? Oh, get him a macchiato. He's on his damn lunch break. Taking my fifteen. Do you fucking mind? Hey, boss. Can I uh, can I order one of everything? Thanks. Your treat, right? Uh, you know I'm good for it. And the fucked up thing is he is good for it. <laughs> yeah. He's he's made some good investments. He's set for life. You look at that man. He's a hard worker. You know he's money smart. But he was never book smart. Are you really doing this right now when I can <laughs> just start saying that at you? Listen, I have to take it where I can. I have so little power in my life. <laughs> I was never book smart. I'm money smart. Makes me more intel, more intelligent. 
She's I mean, just Mr. Real all the time, Chad. I got hella bands. Try to keep my circle to tell her, bring a friend. I was never book smart. I'm money smart. Makes me more intelligent. <laughs> she's gonna make me play this game someday, Chad. She's gonna sing this the whole time. Well, not the whole time. <laughs> this is the face you make when you're singing that to me. It is, honestly. <laughs> Love you, big bud. <laughs> big guy. We we are going to get to um, Gino's maze in the forest, and I am gonna start singing it there. But uh, yo, the pants. Let's go. <laughs> oh, them pants. Let's go. <laughs> Thank you, Pingus. Hey, man. Oh, okay, okay. You want to look at fan art? I'd love to look at fan art. <laughs> You want to look at fan art? I'd love to. That's enough of that for today. I was really scared you were going to open Suica game because if you did that, I was going to open Suica game and then we wouldn't be we would be here for another three hours. <laughs> Honey. Ah, <sighs> oh, okay. SuikaGame.com It sounds so fucking crackly. That's it. Well, now I'm playing Suica game. You have to wait. Turn that shit off. We're looking at fan art. Okay. <laughs> we have some from a stream or two ago that I did not look at yet, so we will look at it now. Yeah. Uh, ominous Dynablade music playing, even though I'm just looking at cute art that I got. But, uh, hey. Just give it a look. Give me a, give me a sec. There we go. This one is very cute. I forgot who made it, and the stream remote is on, so I can't see, but... <laughs> uh, hang on, I'm on a delay, I can't see. Oh, this one is Sludgeware. Uh-huh, this one's really cute. And it's so cute. I, I was yelling at Holly about this one, like, while we were just hanging out. Yeah, and that was, like, when I was also gonna tell you, like, hey, look at this art someone made for us. It's so cute! Very cute. Uh, cute Ernesto Chicken. Thank you very much. You love to see him. That is Ernesto Chicken. I'm gonna go through this a little fast because the Twitch wants me to play an ad so fucking bad when no I'm gonna end. Uh, good birds or maybe chickens. One of the two. You love to see it. Uh, really good Ernesto Chicken. <laughs> oh, Ernesto Chicken. Fucking flounder ass eyes on the side looking bird. That's pretty good. Mm hmm. Uh, this really fucking good one from Glitchy Guts that I saw earlier. Oh, I love the colors on this one. This is great. I, I did, in fact, clap my hands at it like a seal when I went on break. This is fucking awesome. Really, really good. Let's go. 
Let's go. I I I am fucking here uh for the brand new era of people more consistently drawing me wide. It makes me happy to me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> wide Woman Wednesday. Let's Every day. It's Thursday. Wide Woman Wednesday Thursday. This one's from Snowby and I thought it was very cute. It's so cute. <laughs> Look, it's it's the hologram. It's their pose. They're doing it. <laughs> Love to see it. Love to see it. Yay. Another one from Unofficially Jam. Very cute. That's cute. That's cute. The, <laughs> the, the big, big flapping hair. fists. <laughs> Thank you very much. Uh, again from Snowy, Colored. Very cool. Colors! Thank you. Uh, and this next one is from M. Uh, Mothry. Very cute. Love that. Aww. I, I, I like the sad, wet beast eyes. <laughs> mm -hmm. they're, they're, they're very cute. Does not at all uh, convey the, the, the hunger for, for battle in my heart when I play this video game. Very cute. See, see, you have the big, sad, wet eyes because you're not killing anything in this, in this drawing. That's so fucked up. I should boot the game up again and fix that. <laughs> Honey. Very cute fan art. Sorry for rushing it a little bit. I need to end the stream in 40 seconds or Twitch is going to make you look at another ad. Uh, <laughs> thank you all for tuning in. This game fucking rules. More tomorrow, probably. Uh, have a wonderful rest of your night. Thank you for tuning in. Make sure you're taking care of yourselves and taking care of the folks around you. And I hope we see you again soon. Perhaps Good night. very soon. Well, Good night. Hopefully very soon. Good night!